Hello, hello. Radio check. Ow. Hello. Hello. Nothing much. What's up with you? Not much. Cheering. Yup, yup, yup. You off to uh, school front? Mm, not at the moment. I gotta run up to my house. Um, Spencer's waking up, so I'm gonna meet him there. We'll talk. I'll be down in Billy a little later. Alright, cool. I'll see you then. Yep. Okay, stay safe. Yeah, you too. Someone on a bike with the sinister cut on come towards Bay City and then turn around. But yeah. Is that mine? This isn't even mine. <laughs> I can't remember whose card this is. Oh, I found this. And uh, <clears throat> when I went to the scrapyard, someone had left it there. It was weird.
<laughs> this. Okay. <laughs> hey, honey. Sorry, I was taking a poop upstairs. Oh, okay. And I ran outside and saw your bike, so I gave back you in. Surprised the crap out of me. I didn't even hear you. <laughs> really? I mm. literally ran down the stairs and outside. Huh. So, how you been, babe? <sighs> I'm okay. I talked to Jeff a little bit when I was starting my poop, so I gotta go meet with him. Uh, okay. <laughs> um. I'm not going to be president of this fucking club. I, I had to sleep on it, and honestly, I was going to give the whole thing up, but then I woke up, and he says he wants to take the mantle, and I don't believe I got the passion or time to fucking do this again like I did before with Bondi. So okay. I'll let him have it. I think that he's got the time and the energy more so than I do. Okay. You know, I ain't getting any fucking younger at this point, but I'm going to go meet with him and uh, see what's... Do you have anything to eat? I don't. Drink? I was actually going to go over to the shop and grab some stuff. If you want, we should yeah. probably go to the store and get you a new uh, cut. Yeah, I was gonna do that first. Um, fuck. I probably won't starve. It'll be okay. I don't really want to go to that shop right now. I mean, you don't have to go in the shop, but I'm still gonna go and get food and drinks and stuff. Or we could go I'm to take you over there right quick. Or we could go to Burger Shop or whatever. It doesn't matter. No, I like. Alright. I was gonna say, do you want me to run you over to the shop real quick? Or are you gonna go on your own? No. We'll, we'll, we can go together, babe. You don't have to come in, if that's what you mean. I don't want to go in, just in case. I, I don't feel like dealing with that just yet. I want to go talk and figure out some stuff going forward. I'm sure you gotta go down and do your BBMC shit, so. Well, yeah, but um, <coughs> uh, I don't think we're having a meeting until like mid-storm anyway. So, if anything, I'll just, you know, corner, make some money. All right, well, let's go over to the shop then right quick. Okay. You remember how to get there? Oh. Let's take the bike. Which bike? Yours. It's broken. Oh. How's the HSV? Yeah, hey. Hey, Vendetta. God damn it. Every time. <laughs> gotta wait till I do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, honey. Right. You just well, walk so damn though. slow. I will go to fucking Hayes first, I guess. Oh, they're waiting for me. You should change your cut gonna change it before I go up there. Okay. I'm yeah, sorry, honey. I actually... Change it first. You can go right here. I don't want to give the wrong impressions to the other fucking people, because for some reason everyone in this fucking city gives a shit about what everyone else thinks. Well, it's not necessarily about that, but yeah, no, I meant to fix it, and I'm, I forgot, honestly. I'm sorry. Oh, no, blue car. Oh, no. I am wide awake. I don't know what you could possibly be talking about. Curtis. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey. Let's go.
rank they're going to give me yet, so I just put on the normal one. It's okay. Dre's VP, which is shocking to me. Yeah. I, I did not think that man would ever leave that fucking club. Yeah, they both came to me at the same time, saying, I'm leaving, and I'm leaving too. I'm like, what the fuck? Well, fuck that, we're going to Benny's. <laughs> okay. I'm not waiting in line for a fucking hour. Lord puts us closer to where we need to be anyway. This car is struggling. I know. If I, I break it. Oh, hey, life is Vader. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'd bend over backwards for that place. I sure as hell know you would. Uh, excuse me. What? What happened? I don't know what you could possibly be talking about. I'm Still well. Little tiny shorts. Uh, huh? What? Like Daisy Dukes? I don't know what you mean. Uh, yeah, we're in different cuts. Spencer left. Uh, oh, the right, that was a few days ago. Right. What? Nothing. <laughs> Sorry. What? Oh, my. Are you Nothing. okay? I almost ran over a landline, but yes, I'm uh, fine. Alright. <clears throat> Getting used to something. Ugh. <gasps> I do have those shorts, babe. Just turn uh, left here. <laughs> Uh-huh. You got cash? Uh... Yeah. Ah, uh, there's an ATM right here. I'll just... Uh, okay, well, we're closer. And my car's broken. God damn it. That's the freaking... Seriously? <laughs> Bro. It's, it's Jared of all people. Jared. <laughs> you broke my car. On, I don't know where he went. On the way I, to I Benny's. I was turning to the ATM to get cash out to go to Benny's, and now my car is broken. <laughs> Did it actually broke? Yes! Yeah, but, uh, I'm gonna bump you in the bed. Right? <laughs> yeah, I got one. Okay. Alright, I'll go run over to the ATM real quick. No. Yeah. I don't have money to repair that Betty. I have money to repair. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, where are you? Thank you, Jared. Let me know, Ev. See you. Take care. Go up, face it incline, and then I'll. Where's the rich guy? Uh, crossing over Vespucci Boulevard, still on Palmino Ave, northbound. Can you get me in your house? Not awkward at all. Um, there's gotta be in Just to go in a taxi. Hello? Highway <laughs> now, the power freeway. Oh, oh yeah. The carburetor is fucking. Yeah. It's fucked, bud. It's yeah. all gummed up with, uh. Let's see, auxiliary. Synthetic, uh. Carburetor and. Yeah, carburetor oil. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's yeah. the power freeway. Just check yeah. the uh, brake light through it, babe. Exit. I don't know, that was your job. Exit. Uh, about the turn on to South Rockford. Who uses blinkers, anyways? Come on, though. True, but if the fluid's not there, you know, if one thing's messed up, it could throw off everything. That is true. That is true. <laughs> Alright, now it's gonna be dark red. It's gonna fucking uh, need a haze. No. Oh, oh, hell yeah. Oh, God. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and back up this way. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Beautiful. Oh. <laughs> okay, this is going to be an expensive one. Uh, let's see. I was stop. No, $353. What's your number? Which really doesn't look like much. 230 Oh, dear. Okay, one sec. I have eighty-eight dollars on me. That is not a good number. All right. <coughs> oh yeah, there we go. Beautiful. She's so shiny again. Okay. Don't tell me where this fucking place is. I can okay. figure this out. You got it, babe. So we gotta head towards the casino, sort of, kind of. Okay. Know that. Over here. That's the south side. I don't mm -hmm. want to go over there. This is a one-way road. This is also not the way to the casino. Nope. I mean, it's a long way to the casino. Let me get my bearings, damn it. You got it, baby. I trust you. I believe in <laughs> it's you. It's been hard lately. How don't I know it? But no, it's fine. Oh. I'm sure you got it. My brain. Your brain. Okay, we'll go through this nice tunnel here. Mm 
<laughs> oh no, not the freeways. <laughs> but the freeways. Don't worry, baby. Wait. It's not that bad. I know where I am now. Okay. Okay. Yeah, got this. You yep. got this. Right over here. Just give me one second. It is it is around here. To the right. Might be up a bit more, but it's around here. I am I am red. It's up here to the left. You did it. I see it. You did it, babe. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> no markers, no fucking nothing, bud. That's right. This is your city. Just little <laughs> fucking... <coughs> yeah, fuck it all. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, back to the There'd be some bitches walking around here, and then that... Hello. Oh. Hello. Hello. Yeah? Babe, hold your head up. <laughs> oh shit, those are. Yep, you about to get G check. <laughs> nah, you did it wrong. I'm on my way to be with Jeff. I'm his boy. You gotta put more umph in your voices. <laughs> Said I'm never like it. Always keep the back of with the more medical you just can know. Baby. <coughs> Please stop walking like that. <laughs> I remember how I used to walk. I don't care how you walk, as long as it's not with your head down, looking like a sad boy. I'm not gonna have you next to me looking sad. You're supposed to be happy with me, at least. I'm trying. Aren't they pretty? They Can sound you nice. Can put a set in our room? Sure. Uh, I think so, actually. I just really like the sounds of wind chimes on like a nice, breezy night. You know, windows. Mm -hmm. God, but I want to go to bed just thinking about it. Hmm. Oh, hell yeah. I'm feeling good now. All right. Well, good luck, babe. Can I'll see you later. No, you are not about to just leave me here. <laughs> Hell. God, I hate this fucking walk too. I gotta, I gotta figure something out. Where? Uh, that's my old one, but yeah. Where are you meeting them at? Uh, 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 uh I'll just drop you off at the house. That's not what I asked you. Hey, excuse me. Mm. Yeah, I would like to join Sinister Soul. Uh, that's nice. Waiting. Hey, one suited down, but hey, I think our first war is the bottle, so no cap. I'm gonna be okay. What? Yeah, all right, bro. What? What? What about BBMC? Nothing. Oh, okay. You guys are some cool people. Oh, that's what I thought I heard. That's fine, baby. So I'm going to White Widow Farms. Oh, okay. Sh Jeff took my keys away from for some <laughs> fucking dumbass reason. I guess he thought that he'd text me and say, take off the presence patch, me and Dre are taking over, and thought maybe I'd get pissed off or something. But anyways, that's where I'm going. So that's fine. That's, I guess, the turf we're going to hold down. I'll tell yeah. you anything. I don't give a fuck. You're more important than any club or anyone in this fucking city to me, and I know you're not going to say, say the same thing. 
I wouldn't. I, if you had to choose between me or BBFC, what would you choose? You. Okay, I retract my statement then. I don't have a soul bond with BBMC. It's a blood bond, but it's not soul. And the th the thing about it is, honey, like, I'm yeah, the club comes first to a point, but you're my husband. You're my actual husband. We are literally spoke to the gods to bless our union. I am not that invested. I am, however, I would be concerned at this point if you asked me to choose. I would never made him for most things unless it was go what we're having for fucking dinner <laughs> okay i would say babe we are having pizza or we're having tacos that is your ultimatum hey get back in here what do you, what do you actually know? okay god damn it okay, <laughs> all right love you i love you too okay oh uh, okay give me something to think about huh mm-hmm all right, we'll link up and we'll, we'll be something. We'll Listen, get this shit figured out. I don't know if they have checked their messages, but I need to speak to both of them. Okay. I'll let them know. I'll let them know. All right. Do you want to speak to them as Christina or do you want to speak to them as the queen of his Gucci? What's the difference? I mean, I don't know, but I'll let them know. All right. All right. Yep. Drive safe, all right? You drive safe. Put your harness on. Never. Honey. Okay, thank you. I'm going to do my best piss Miss Ellen. Right? Morning. Oops, sorry. Hey, what's up? Thank God Tyson is fully built. Yeah, he built Diffie. Oh. Actually, Jared, I need to talk to you. Mm -hmm. I need I need to talk to Jared alone for a minute about that very thing. So, um, <coughs> all right. So, um, you know, apparently some some stuff went down like after I went to bed in AU. And there was like a conversation with Ed and Jeff about them blooding out properly and all of that. Then there was a shootout. Ed at the hospital Ed and Jeff went to the hospital and Ed at that time said that as far as he's concerned, his he's blooded out and they're good. They still need to deal with Dre. Well yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, however, after that some people um, in the club felt like it wasn't sufficient like 
you know, he got shot when he was driving away rather than, you know, just standing, you know, standing and taking it. Yeah. But the thing is, Jeff said that he'd be blooded out if I was the one to do it. Um, and, and also heard he wouldn't do because of that's he and he and Dre both said they don't really care to be blooded out because then it's not the same club that they were blooded into, which is the reason why they're leaving because things are different in a in a not good way. Um, there's people not having you know respect for command and just all kinds of stuff issues that they were having that they couldn't you know resolve. So, um, but. Jeff did say that, you know, they came to me first to let me know that they were leaving. Um, and Jeff at that time said, can you hear me now? Yeah. yeah. So they came to me to let me know they were leaving. And during that whole conversation, they were talking about, you know, how they felt. Jeff said up front, if anybody has the right to blood me out, it would be you. Because I essentially blooded him in. Um, so, however, after all of that, that went down and Ed said that he was good, Jeff took that as he's blooded out. Um, so he, he, I said, do you consider yourself blooded out or do I need to do it still? He said, Ed, the PM said I'm blooded out. So I'm blooded out. I said, okay. Um, and so I came back down here to find out what was going on from the club perspective. They pretty much told me the same thing, but because um, there were so many people that didn't agree with Ed's decision, he just basically backtracked and said, okay. Um, About the bloody Yeah. Backtracked and said, that, you know, the two of them should, you know, come down here or meet up somewhere or whatever um, so that they could be blooded out properly. Yeah. Um, okay. Fair enough, I guess. Um, for me, like personally, I don't like that. Like Dre still needs to be dealt with, but Ed said it's done. It should be done. There shouldn't be any more discussion old. after that. But whatever. He said it's what he weird said. Because we probably agreed on blooding out. You know, like we're not meant to even, you know, be, <laughs> we're meant to like see them as dead. So. Right. Yeah, that's yeah, that's business that has nothing to do with it. But um, yeah. So as far as I can see, so here was my uh, uh, I don't know if it'll work or not, but I suggested that um, I will call. I've reached out to Dre and Jeff um, to you know have a conversation with them. And it may be possible for me to get them to agree to blood out if I do it. Um, they're, awake this time, right? they're awake right now. They're actually meeting. Um, Spencer's oh, with them right now. So, um, but um, yeah. So I was. That was my. That was my thinking. I talked to Josh. I talked to Johnny. Um, Mike was there. Um, so that's all that was around at the time in command and Austin was supposed to have gotten that message relayed to him too. So, um, yeah, hopefully. So my thinking is if I can get them to just, you know, meet with me and maybe one other person, just so we have a witness to it, that we can get it done clean and, you know, quiet and out the way. We don't have to have a major conflict or drama. You know, we can just yeah, exactly. be done with it and move on. So there's no bad blood. Yeah, yeah so that that's my thinking. I'm going to meet with them a little later. Or I'm going to try at least. Um, so so I can have that conversation. And they can, they can say yes or no, but all I can do is try. At least. <laughs> Why, though? <laughs> Control yourself, man. Okay, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Muscle spasms. So anyway, that's crazy. But yeah, so that's, I just wanted to put you in the loop since, you know, I'm pretty sure you probably haven't been able to talk to command since then, so. 
Yeah, so, um, and I had to kind of fill Josh in too when he woke up uh, last storm or I guess EU. Yeah, Josh didn't know it's about the Angelo situation until like five days later. I didn't know anything about the Angelo situation until it actually it came down like to it. Yeah, I had no and idea. Was getting fed up that it took so long for Kelly to be punished. Mm. So, anyway. There was a lot of us in the meeting. She was like, five commando was getting ready to start. We were waiting for you know, Josh to wake up so we could all talk about it. Mm. And then I jumped in. Yeah. Well, anyway, I just wanted to make sure that you knew what was going on so that it wouldn't come as a surprise to you if, you know, you got a call saying, come here, I need you, or, you know, it's already done. Yeah, and not, and not know. Oh, it needs a, like needs a lot of work. We do need a lot of work uh, and a lot of help, especially around this time. And as far as I can see, NA2. Um, but I, um, I had actually talked to a couple of people who were in command at the time. They are no longer in command. Um, Shiloh and um, who was I talking to? Sh oh, Dre. Shiloh and Dre. Um, about you know what I've been observing and how I can help um, if it helps. Like uh, I, my jacket wasn't my white jacket wasn't taken from me. I handed it over. Um, because mm. what I needed a yeah, break. Exactly <laughs> you heard what there. I, know you stepped down. I stepped down for a couple of reasons because the tensions were really high. That was right after the whole um, stuff with Mac and Hannah and me being hunted for like four days and all of that. And there was yeah, just a lot that was very stressful. So, you know, even before that, like when Spencer stepped down and I stepped in and then Jeff stuck over and then, you know, everything was just so messy um, that I needed a break, essentially. And I didn't, I, I knew that there was some, I don't want to say bad blood, but definitely some tensions when it came to me in command. So I just decided to just, you know, step back, be a member, be helpful however I could, you know, do everything that I, that I always did without the authority backing it. I mean, I'm still the founder. I'm still, you know, I should have that level of respect, but um, yeah, it, I just didn't. Be a part of the club because I didn't know if you were going to go with Spencer. I don't, oh, as far as this, I don't want to leave. I understand why he left. I understand why people wanted him to leave. Um, yeah, I mean, but, chances, you know, at this point. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't, I'm not going to. No, and he doesn't want to either, so it's okay. Um, I I don't want to go. Um, honestly, I have. I was here at the beginning, and I want to be here until the end. And like, if unless someone decides that I'm no longer worthy of this patch, and I can't imagine what I could possibly do in order to to make that, you know, a thing. So. Okay. Yeah, it's good um, to hear you want to be here till the end. I was here at the beginning. I want to go down with the ship. If it goes down and it breaks, I'm going to be the last one standing. That's how I feel about mm -hmm. it. So unless, mm -hmm. you know, my husband up and dies, um, I'm not going anywhere. Um, mm -hmm. So, uh, so yeah, that's um, that's how I feel about it. I'm sure anything else that has to do... Um, ever, I'm sure that there's, um, a way for him to, to get back in, but it's not going to be, like, right away, and, um, yeah, it's time for him to, confused. sure, and then it's time for him to evaluate whether or not he even wants to be back in command or anything like that, and so, what I said, what I was telling people, you know, when I had the opportunity was, I... If command feels, you know, I don't know what's the word I'm looking for here. If they see it suitable, I wouldn't mind taking a, putting my jacket back on um, in a position. I don't know what that, necessarily what that role would be. I could be chaplain again. 
or an enforcer or whatever. Um, yeah, I feel like we need another chaplain or two. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. Um, yeah, just, just something, like, I don't have to be, you know, at the top like I was, but some more representation needs to be here and more authority figures need to be here because it, I have seen over the past few weeks, a uh, couple months actually at this point, that the club, the patches are pretty much running themselves and that's not the, the greatest thing, you know? Um, yeah, it kind of sucks the, when Edward can be around, you know, it's usually AU most of the time. It's like late AU when it's not often. Um, and like, and Josh had to change his schedule, which is fine. But at the same time, it leaves, it leaves the, um, the club open and vulnerable. And there's no, because a lot of the OGs are leaving, there's no, there's no education anymore. There's no structure. There's a lot of, you know, things like sure things should change and grow and evolve but the foundations should still remain or at least be understood yeah. it's almost a new club at this point yeah and that's and that's yeah cuz there's a lot of people who have come in and they have no idea about you know what we what we are were built on and like i said things can grow and change but if you don't know where you come from then it's hard to go forward you know, properly. So that's how I feel about it. But in the meantime, it, it basically, it's just like just structure and knowledge. If anything, I have the experience in political matters and club stuff, business. So I just feel like I can help some kind of way. Um, at least, like I said, to be a presence of authority, if not even in the club, but outside the club, so people know who to come to rather than just having a, a, a junior patch member, you know, cop. try to make decisions, you know? Yeah, I mean, with the new VP and the uh, team, I feel like the club's, you know, going in a better direction. Maybe less drama, we can do a better more. I, I agree. There's been definite improvements. There's more gelling and stuff like that. However, right the issue that I have... And that yeah. even the members have had, because I've talked to people, and they said the the biggest issue that they see right now is that the command presence just isn't there for them. And if they need to go and talk to somebody, they can't because they're not awake. Yeah. So. Yeah, I've been busy the past week. Though. Sure. Yeah. But then it's that it's that um, that AU. Um, yeah, I'm like the first AU. Of AU so yeah. Right. Yeah. So lately, when I'm here, it's usually first half of AU. Um, but I'm also, like, coming in different storms. So um, for exactly that reason, to observe and see, you know, what's going on, how people are moving and all of that. I'm here in comms. I've seen you know, what people have been doing in war and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, the, the group we have is gelling, but there's still some, a little bit of a lack of direction. So they're good as a group together, but when it comes to, like, order, um, it's lacking, you know, and stuff like that. And, um... I wouldn't say there's a disrespect per se issue, but it, uh, I can see where um, some command are coming from when they say they don't respect because Josh will say something and make an announcement and then people go and do the opposite anyway because he's not here and there's nobody to check them, you know. Um, um, people questioning command decisions. Um, when it really shouldn't be that much of a question. Like, of course, we should hear opinions and thoughts and take those into consideration, but at the end of the day, if command has said something that's, like, it, and if there's something wrong and it doesn't work, then we can talk about it and figure out how to fix it. But 
you know. Some of Joshua's deals I did not agree with because the mayor built the corner in here. That's just not fine. That was just totally against that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I was definitely pushing against that. I don't like them taking our corner. Yeah, who's selling drugs right now? I was. Yeah. Yeah, but see, you're in command, so the trick, here's the other thing. There's an issue of command communicating with each other. And so, right. But if you're not being able to communicate, so if there's somebody who was able to be a go-between, between the storms, and relay information, that's... That's a good thing to do. I wish there was a group message like in the city. Yeah. 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 Just figured I'd let you know. Appreciate it. Do you want to get some food for anyone? Ready. Okay. Be safe. Thanks, you too. Alright. Um, so yeah. Um, like I said, there's, there's a lot of different, you know, things that may seem small, but they end up being a really big deal. Like, sure, there may be command during every storm, but there's not command across the storms. Mm -hmm. You know, like, in that, in that mid section like yeah, we were trying late to, to early set up, you know, sometime in the mm -hmm. just like yeah so if there's like i said if it were me um i could meet with command at the beginning or mid storms or whatever just to make sure that everybody's in the loop of of things if something were to happen that you know that needs to be relayed but um like I said, I, I'm just I'm just spitballing here. I'm trying to make sure that people understand what I'm trying to do is for the club. Yeah, I wasn't awake when the shit happened this morning. I heard about it though. Yeah, man, I'm with Chris right now if you guys want to handle it. Just me. Yeah, we're having we're talking on the show. So. And Dre, is Dre awake? Like everyone hates us down there, but um, I'm fine. Well, that's not necessarily true, actually. But yeah, um, I, don't I don't either. I would still be friends with you. Mm -hmm. All right, I gotta that's be in my head. Angela was asking me, is this shoot on set? I was like, no. I'm no. Like, I'm never hurt, I'm never hurt you 
you just can't. Mm-hmm. Especially if it's, it's but no, there really isn't. They didn't do anything to the club mm-hmm. per se. So I gotta be in my head for a minute. I'll be right here. Okay. Yeah, I'll be back in a few minutes. Alright. Back chat. Oh my goodness, chat. The drama. Jackson, yeah, hop on real quick. Some shit, some, uh, personal stuff, so. oh, okay. I love how you don't even question. <laughs> <laughs> I just need you to do me a quick favor. Yeah. So I need this stuff uh, stashed in the yeah, mailbox. Uh, for you're me. doing clean art. Yeah, you're. Yeah, you're doing. Just in case. Just in case. Just in case. Yep. Yep. I figured that much. I I don't trust any of them right now. At this point. I'm not concerned about it. I just don't want to have it on me for any reason if I'm not actually using it. Yep. We can just stack it in the box. Listen. 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 Not worried about it. I just don't want to have the stuff on me in case something happens yeah. and cops come down here. That's all. Um, do either <laughs> of them have access to the mailbox? Only Spencer does. And so that money is mine and his, so I don't give a shit. So it's fine. Okay. <laughs> Did you. Mm-hmm. Did you drop it? Can you do knuckles? Yeah. Knuckles, what else? Uh, advanced lock picks, maybe. Okay, how many? Uh, just do like five. Okay. If I send Anybody you else? a pair of knuckles. Somebody else said they needed yeah, knuckles. Wait, where are my knuckles? Yeah. 
No, no, no. I have some. I have some. I just need to go get them. Uh, cancel. I don't need. I don't need knuckles. I'll be back. Nolan said he wanted some knuckles. Hey, baby. What are you doing? Uh, I just needed to grab something from that um, one of my cars. What's up? Are you going, Tyson? Are you alone? At the moment, uh, yeah. Tyson, I'm in why the fuck would you not tell me that BBMC and Sinister Souls are killing each other? What do you mean? It only happened... There was only one incident that I know of. From what it sounds to me, it sounds like there's a lot of fucking tension, and that makes me feel pretty fucking awkward. Well, tension, sure, because of how it was left, but... I mean, I didn't really... Bill's threatening to... Jeff. Phil you threatens know? everybody when uh, they leave, your wife is here but you. he left, so I don't want to hear that shit. Phil's not even here. <laughs> I'm at the fucking e ATM, by the way. You need some money? Which ATM? Uh, over by... I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Uh, money? sure, babe. Uh, you can give me some money. Can be, uh, what, you what you got? On the beach. I got 200k. Oh shit. Damn, daddy. What pay? Yeah, I just paid for my car, so. Down bad. <laughs> State ID, I should have. You should know it by now. Tell me. 35302. There you go, babe. Thank you, honey. I hope you know that no matter what happens with the, if we go to war, I will never fucking shoot you. you I wouldn't shoot, shoot me all you fucking want. I wouldn't shoot you either. If we go to war, then uh, we, I don't know, that might have to be something that you know we work out with the respective clubs. I talked to the souls about it already, and they already assured me that you know if you're there defending the Billy, and you know shit happens, they're not gonna fucking wipe you. We'll take your gun. And that's it. That's about the best I can do at this point. That's fine. I don't like it, but, you know, this I mean, is, the only thing that, the reason this is happening is because y'all want to fucking blood Dre and Jeff out that fucking bad. I mean, don't say y'all. <laughs> I honestly don't, at the club, sure. The powers that be. Sure. But, um, I'll tell you, you keep it to yourself. Can I trust you? Uh, yes. Okay. Of course. I mean, I know I can trust you, but I'm just letting you know I need you not to say this. Um, I've had a conversation with several members of command um, to see if we can work it out so that it doesn't have to be messy and loud and, um, you know, a spectacle and shit. Um, I don't know, you know, like, let me talk to Dre and, and Jeff and see if we can. Dre just got here. He just woke up. Okay. You're giving me a little, I'll give you a little. Yeah, that's fine. Um, Do you know who else is in Sinister Souls, by the way? No idea. Uh, besides Steven? I did not know Steven was... I'm sorry. So I had to fucking kiss his ass and say, let's let bygones be bygones. But, yeah. I, I'm, anyways, continue, babe. I'm sorry. Yeah. Like, put it this way. If you're going to be Bondi and claim to be Bondi, then leave Bondi the right way right so you know obviously you're the founder you get to walk but they're not you know and it, I'm just speaking on a you know just strictly business wise club wise I think that you can appreciate it at least this is how you leave right if you're blooded in you get blooded that. out it's just that simple so it's not about wanting to do it it's just about what's done so you know. Jeff's told me himself he only wants you to do it. So maybe he'll agree to that, but don't you and Jared come rolling up here and say nobody's, the right well, way. I mean, nobody's I rolling up doing that. anything. <laughs> I will have the conversation. I would like to have at least one other member, preferably command or a senior member, but I'm pretty much the seniorest member. 
Um, I thought Jerry was coming up. We're gonna have a chat. Um, uh, with Jared was on the phone with Jeff, I think, and he was like, "Y'all can come on down, and it'll be fine." Um, but like I said, I want to have a conversation privately with Jeff and Dre. Um, and if it goes down like that, if they agree to it, then uh, another person will be there just so it can be a witness and it can be said that it was done. All right. Okay. Just, I don't want this, this to get fucking weird. It's already weird, babe. I'm just, I'm just trying to keep it from being. I know it's weird, but I'm just trying to keep it from being messy. Is, is I, that's what I'm talking about too. I don't want y'all to come rolling up here because we're not coming down to the Billy. Let's be okay, honest. Okay, well if then you we can my meet. Situation, I can. That's fine. We can meet so, on neutral. That's what I heard. Territory. From this is between you and I. This is not club to club. This no, is of course. me and my wife. Yeah, Chris. We're not gonna roll down there. If you guys don't want to roll up here, that's fine. But I'm sorry. One sec. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Fuck. Um. Yeah. No, that's fine, babe. Um, but don't antagonize because I don't know everyone. There's, well, good. I know Steven, but there's another guy up here I don't know. And I don't want one of these guys to get trigger happy and shoot you. And then I got to shoot him. And then I'm in a worse situation than I was yeah, I know. before I woke up tonight. That's, that's what I'm saying. I want it to be clean and quiet and just, you know, over and done. I, I'm not trying to make a spectacle. I'm not trying to start no shit. I'm trying to prevent shit from happening. All right. Well, I'm taking a long time to get a fucking radio. So I'm going to head back. You should call jo Jeff or Dre and see what we can fucking work out. I'm right now, I guess, apparently just an OG patch member. I, I don't know, but we're still trying to figure things out. But I, I, I don't know. Just please think about us with the most important thing. Of course. Okay. Yeah. I love you. Love you too. No matter what. I love you too. Even if you chose the wrong side. I'm just kidding. Don't li listen. <laughs> No matter what, you still gotta go home with me tonight. So. No matter what, I chose the right side because I get to lay down beside that fucking body. <laughs> every night. All right, honey. Hey, okay, I'm sorry, but it's true. All right, well, I'm heading back. I'm almost back at the farm, so I'll talk to you soon. And you know, let's please. Anyways, you get it. You're smart. Bye. Love you. Bye. Love you too. Jared, where you at? I'm cooking real quick and then we can head out. Are we going out there? Uh, yeah. Uh, Stephen called me back and said they're not comfortable coming down. That's fair enough, but I'm not comfortable going up there. So can we meet somewhere in the middle? Or somewhere neutral? We could meet in, like, Legion Fourth Square, thing. I guess. Mm, not seeing... Legion Square is where bad things happen. <laughs> but, um, um, what's happening right now? I'll tell you, what, am, what am I missing? Hang on a second. Um, I have a house in a harmony. Uh, finish cooking, we'll talk. Uh, we're gonna have a meeting with uh, Sinister. Okay. Who's going? I'd like to be there. No. Why? No. It'll be me and Jared. Okay. Okay. Don't worry. <laughs> we have location? We haven't worked that out yet. Well, that's like what we're talking about. You're not responding on radio within a certain right. period of time. We can do, we can do wellness checks. We'll, when we figure it out, then I'll let you know. Okay. He's not going to hurt his wife. He will not. Exactly. And if anything, you know, if anything does happen, then at the very least, uh, Spencer is going to make sure that I get help. Okay? So okay. that's why I feel comfortable and confident. Um, um, uh, I'm very worried about what all... I'm gonna share, you know, with everybody because I don't want it to be a big thing. 
but right. I'm gonna have a conversation and you know see if we can't get things straightened out so it doesn't get messy. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, just curious, Jeff and Dre have yeah. let Spencer in. They've kicked they him didn't out. Let like him in. Spencer came. Was originally started. Right? Correct. Now. Yeah. <laughs> Spencer has said. Spencer said that he didn't really want command if you know he he trusts them to to lead it or whatever. But they are together okay so they're they gonna get out. blooded out so that remains to, that remains to be seen but that's what the conversation is about oh, okay okay Alrighty. <sighs> curious what's going on Business. yeah no. we'll let everybody what know mean? what needs to be known when the time comes you just Hi. trust trust your OG, trust command. Trust the process? Trust the process. If nothing else, trust me. I've been here longer than anybody. I, I, I know how okay. to do this. Hey, JC, how you doing? Good, how are you? You wanted Knuckles? No, I didn't. Nolan wants Knuckles. <laughs> well, I got, I got Knuckles to go around. <laughs> okay. Nolan. I think he's actually Nolan. at the shop. He may not be able to hear. Uh, I'll call him. Yeah, well, if you need me, just give me a call. Alright. You um, might have had the player. I'll have a look at him. Not really, uh, there you go, you can have that. Thank you. Hmm. So what, do I just use it? Yep. Or Yep, just use it. Oh, shit. Yeah. Uh. That'll knock a local out in one hit and uh, a regular human in two. Wow. That's so awesome. Yep. That's my preferred method of discipline in the club. I like it. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, JC, uh, he's gonna be down here in five to ten. All right, so let's let's figure this out. Cause I, if something anyone? does get you know ugly, yeah, I don't want to be all the, the way in grapeseed. Okay. You know what I mean? I mean, okay. if they honestly did something to us, I would be. Try and like that. I'd be surprised, but I don't mm. doubt that. I mean, cause Spencer is there and he's gonna be there, so I know that one he's not gonna do anything. But if something happens, then he will make sure that we get transported. But if that's the case. And if we end up having to transport people, I don't want to drive all the way from Grape Seat down here to Viceroy and then back up. I mean, I feel like I'm still good friends with Jeff and Jason. So Same. Like Same. And like I said, it's a conversation that needs to happen, but I'd rather be closer to this city, just in case. Because uh, it's like... Th um... Let me think for a second. You want to stay in the city? Yeah. I'd like to. Um, maybe we can Here's go uh, up to like. Chris's business. I don't want to do that there. Cause here's the thing. My goal at the end of this conversation is to have two people on the ground. So I need to. I want to be able to bring them to the hospital. Michael. Anybody oh, need anyway. VPN? Anything like that? While I'm so. Under? What? Wait, who are you talking about? Dre and Jeff. Steven? No. You said Michael. Who's Michael? I said my intention is to have oh. two people on the ground. So I want to be able to get them to the hospital and back to wherever we meet at. So we don't have to go, you know, halfway through the island just to, you know. Um, so what if we met somewhere like, I don't know, one of the theaters or something in Vinewood? Yeah. Where it's mm -hmm. private, and then you know. Um, yeah, yeah, either the Vinewood Bowl or the Sisyphus Theater. Sisyphus, or even the back of the casino, maybe. 
Yeah, they can do scheme too if you want. Yeah. Yeah, because that's like principal, yeah. Hey, uh, DC, what is, uh, what's yeah, your, uh, can you take your stage? Can you maybe just call them and see if they're down for the casino? Uh, yeah. Oh. Or just, like, somewhere oh, in Vinewood, that way. Uh, your, do you take your, uh, what? I mean, uh, around everything. Uh, text. Oh. Okay. Uh, I'm I went and had bandages too, and I left them in the car. Uh, they did. Uh. Hey, Tyrese. All is well. Good to see you. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome to the drama. Alright. Yeah, they're down in the crew. So. You guys okay. Leave or? Fair. All right. Uh, so we'll need a four door. Just in case. All right. Uh, yeah. Yeah. No. 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 <laughs> okay, we will. We will be at the casino, so we should still be in range. Okay. You can do a wellness check right. in like fifteen minutes. Either way. We should be fine, okay? <laughs> All right. Thank you. We're in the race. All right. Could you drive there? I got. I'll be in my head for that. Sure. Yeah. I got you. Need to go to bed. Let's do your down. I'll tell you that. Okay. I'll be in my head for the first couple minutes. All the smashes. Easy. <laughs> Thank you. I'm at the vault.
yo. Hey, uh, did you just call Jared? Uh, no, I didn't call Jared. Oh, okay. I was just checking. We were uh, waiting at the casino for uh, you guys. Oh, we're at, uh, in the back. I was just saying, because he's in his head right now, so if you were trying to reach him, that's why he didn't answer. Oh, no, no. I haven't been calling. I'm just waiting at the casino for y'all. We're here. Oh, you're here? Yeah. Where? In the back. Okay, we'll be there in a sec. Yeah. Where can I? Right. I'll be looking. They're good. They're here. They're just coming from the front. Where can I get NOS? This repair was cheap as, as hell. I thought it would be much more expensive. Mm -hmm. It's only like, it was not even $200. You can NOS from uh, Harmony or Tuna Shop. Chris. What's going on? Run? Hello, yeah. Steven. Hey, Gan. Hey, baby. Hey. You good? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Hey, mother. God damn it. I didn't know. How, when did we not hug each other? The fuck? Where is, uh, slow Can down. Where what? is, uh, Dre at? Uh, yeah, I thought he was coming. Uh, God, uh, no. I don't think he's I even in the city anymore. No, Dre's awake. He was... Honey, do you have no, any bandages? Uh, down. All right, we're at, uh, remember where we used to park by the racetrack near the back of the casino? Yeah, we're there. All right, buddy. Bye-bye. Oh, I hung up on him. I, I do that, too, all the time. The people. <laughs> One of you guys yeah, have a bandage? Uh, yes, I do. Here, yeah. Chris, I can see it. Thank you. Here you go. Appreciate it. No problem. You need it over there? I have no idea where he's at. You can call him. Who, Spencer? I, no, Dre. I called him. Spencer is on the phone with Dre now. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, Dre was on his way and he had to stop and get gas, but he's coming here right now. Oh. Boom. How's the uh, Sinister Souls going? Pretty I damn good, man. Sinister Souls. We're keeping it. Our plan is to keep it small, like Sinister's always been. Maybe nine or ten people, and that's it. And uh, you know, do banks, and you know, we're gonna be powerful, but small. Yeah, that's Where's your like compound at? Or hangout? Uh, we're hanging out at White Widow right now. White Widow Farms. Is that any uh, oh, nice. compound or anything? Yeah, but we're looking at places. We got like a few lines in the water. Some gangs have talked about like us moving into different areas. So we're just. Fuck <laughs> 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 that. Oh, someone. <laughs> What's his name again? Autumn. Autumn. Mar. He gets he gets angry if we call him Autumn. Black. Can someone text me his name? How do you spell it? How does he spell it? Yeah, exactly. That's that's my, Jared. You took the thought from my fucking mind. <laughs> also, text me his number if you. To be honest. So you guys drive by. I was like, is that the DMC or? Mm -hmm. How's the bloody eye gonna go? I mean, Jeff was already flooded out and Joshi made flat, so I was kind of waiting for Joshi to Yeah, I think we're just going to do it officially right now as well. Jared. Oh my god, Jared. Because I heard it was kind of weird before. Yeah, well... Listen, I've been blooded out, and if you guys intend to blood me out again, it's... Uh, god damn it. Oh, you don't want to know what you're going to do? I thought that's what no. you were supposed to do. 
that's 100%. Jared, duh. Disrespect to Bondi, I but I, mean, was I wasn't there either. He shot me in the back, so yeah. he got gunned down along with everybody oh, else. Shit. Like, He's back. I would have preferred it happen. You know, no one texted me, by the way. I mean, but Dre's already like you know, already like talked to us about it. I'm gonna let him talk to you about it too. Yeah, he'll be here in a sec. Like that's why I was a. Uh, Awesome. Since we're gonna make use of the bike again? Yeah, I spoke to Josh about it. He said the, uh, he thinks... I don't have I mean, to use that. That's Jeff, my bad. I don't know why I said Sun's name. It's all yeah. good, bro. Uh, I don't know if he spoke to the... To be he needs the keys, Jeff. Yeah, I don't care what the club says. Uh, your command, your president and VP are saying it's done. I really don't give a shit what the rest of the club says. It's not my concern. Well, Dre's here, so let's have our hey, conversation Dre. and figure fucking things out. Okay, so this is... This is actually how it's gonna go. Um... I'd like to have a conversation with Jeff and Dre um, off to the side. And you all can, you know, just. Uh, I'd like Steven to come with. I, I don't want to have Steven excluded. Um, uh, Spencer, if you want to come, you can too. It's just I need Steven's uh, you know, moral compass. That's up to you, man. Whatever you guys want, if you want me to come. But I. No. I don't know. No. no. I would like to talk to Jeff and Dre personally. You all can. Watch from a distance. Make sure everything is kosher. I just want to have a conversation. Listen, Steven keeps a bottle on me. It's like just beneficial to have him around. He's right there. <laughs> I just want to have a chat. Okay. Hey guys. Hi. Okay. So. I don't. Um. Ow. I don't want to drag this out. I don't want it to be messy. <coughs> uh, that's the meteor. Alright. Can you hear me, Dre? Alright. Can everybody hear me? Hello? Hello? I can hear you, Dre. Jeff? Hello, I can hear you now. Jeff? Yeah, yeah. Okay, everybody, yeah, okay, good. So, yeah, I don't want to drag this out. I I told people that I would talk to you guys because I don't want it to get messy, and I heard about what happened, uh, Jeff, when you went down to the building. I already talked to you about it. As far as I'm concerned, um, for whatever it's worth, you, you got shot. Ed said, you're done, you're blooded out. I'm fine with that. But, um... Uh, the, I, I'm trying to avoid problems. Yeah, I get you. You know? Like, the main problem is you guys can't get up, like, not you guys, you're not command. Mm -hmm. The command can't get a hold of their fucking club, and their club, you know, going against what the VP and the president said. Right, so I'm not here for that. I'm, I'm not here for that. If Josh and, and, and Ed said, Jeff, you're straight, you're squashed, fine, but now we still have Dre to deal with. And the... Yeah, I'm not letting you go out. I'm... Okay, let's not talk like that. 
Okay, I'm not giving I'm you. I'm not gonna walk my, in front of the board. I'm not giving demands. I'm just having a conversation. I know, I know, I know. So I don't, I don't want to be threatened. References. I, I, I know what you mean. You know. I'm just. I, I'm just. This is not a negotiation. Stuff. It's a conversation. So what you're not gonna do, Jeff, is tell me what I'm not gonna do. I'm just talking to you. Okay. I'm not meaning to disrespect you. And I apologize. If you feel that way. Thank you. Continue. Thank you. What I'm asking you, if there is any way, if you're not going to, I don't have to shoot you, but people want the blood. And now the thing that you all said when you left is that Bondi isn't Bondi anymore. And I'm just saying, if you blood it into Bondi, you should blood out of Bondi. So, right? Yeah, I was shot in the back. And, and I laid on the ground. Bleeding. And I'm with you on that. I'm I'm here for that. I'm not. I have no argument with that. My this. my problem is that the bond, the current Bondi doesn't deserve my blood. So I didn't blood into that. And that statement feel, makes you guys feel disrespected and bring war. But that's the thing. Nobody and wants to have a war because somebody left. That's dumb. Well, I mean, they didn't let <laughs> they it just go. come hunt me down. I I understand how things work. No, you down. I'm gonna hunt you guys down. Like, period. Alright. No, it's nothing personal. I I understand that that's what you're supposed to do. But I, I shouldn't have been able to leave the billy without getting gunned down. Right. But there was nobody at the billy, and it was just you, and you said you couldn't make that call as a past member, which is No, fine. I couldn't, like, but that's why I went and talked to command. Great. Correct me if I'm wrong, but you're saying you don't respect the current boss guy, and they don't deserve your blood. Yes. Okay, so if you would like to make us respect Bondi and, you know, deserve Dre's blood, bring war to us. Like, I don't want war. It's not what I want. I want you just to drop this and leave Dre alone. I... You, you know, you're not going to do that, so... I understand that you, you see me as Bondi right now. I got the jacket on and all of that, mm -hmm. and I'm not speaking for the club, per se. I'm talking as Chris, okay? And Chris does have... You know, Chris is Bondi, but I'm not speaking on behalf of all of Bondi. I did talk. It is what it is, but I'm not wrapped up in anything. I'm he I'm in there because I choose to be there. I started the club, and I will end with the club as 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 far as I can. You well, know. If, if anything ever happens, like I want you to know, I really would want you to come to White Widow and run that and get our weed and try to take this job. I can't do it. Anything ever happened to where like Bondi and us are allies? Could you do it with Johnny? Well, I can't I put it this way. I can't own anything, um, but I can I can I can help you know run it. But like I need your help there, and I was scared that you weren't going to give it because of like what's going on. But like, yeah. Those are two different things. Business is business, and Spencer is still my husband. And if we do over time you know develop an alliance it, it has to be a strong one first of all um and so that you know it doesn't become a conflict of interest it's already i don't need like, <laughs> exactly so what i'm saying is i'm trying like i said i because i couldn't in good conscience make a decision without command i did speak with command um to talk to them to see if there was a way because if like i said i didn't have the whole story at one time but you said the only person you would accept is me blooding you out so if you didn't consider yourself being blooded then you know we could handle that Dre? Nah, they, they should, should see that as a blessing that i'm not bringing war to them where edward's shooting me instead of telling him the only person that could blood me out is chris he disrespected me by shooting he's lucky i didn't rob everybody there I just killed all the 15 people and took them to the hospital. We didn't rob anybody. And they're lucky I didn't. The next time it's not going to be like that. Definitely. I'm tired of them disrespecting me. I'm tired of them circling me up, saying I'm not trusted, saying like they don't like me. I'm tired of that shit. I'm not going to bitch out to these people. It's not about them. <laughs> it's per se. Like I said, this is me. This is my thought. This is my conversation. And like I said, I said, let me talk to them and see what we can do. If, you know, if it if it came to it, then I would go ahead and do it. If not, 
then it is what it is. Y'all can say whatever you want. I'm just here saying, can we do this or get the situation handled without it getting messy and turning into war and all of that? Okay. Like, the way the situation can be handled is drop it on Dre alone, and if not, like, we're going to retaliate. If you come at us first, we're a small group, you guys are 50, you come at us, we're going to retaliate. But it's not about the whole club. Nobody's against Sinister Souls. Okay, when you come at me, I'm going to retaliate. I have so many, let me, hold on one second. Let me do this for you. I have so many allies in this fucking city, I have more than Bondi underneath my wing. There's nothing you can do to stop me. Nothing. Jeff, again, I feel like you're threatening me. And I'm I need- I'm not threatening you. I, I have <laughs> strict fucking orders, well not orders, but suggestions from my fucking patch member Spencer never to shoot you in a gunfight. You will never be shot in a gunfight. If you fucking just put your fucking gun down or just run away or just not shoot and just hide, like you will never be shot. I guarantee that. I'm not worried I'm about that. I appreciate that. I'm just saying, okay, so I'm gonna put it this way. I understand that you're um, passionate and it's coming off aggressive, okay? And yeah, again, I understand I'm not, I'm talking, well, fair enough, but I'm just saying we're, we're friends talking right now, okay? So yeah, it's, it's not meant to come off as aggression like that. It's, mm -hmm. I'm doing aggression like you know a one percenter does, like the diamonds on your back. Uh huh. That's, that's right. I mean, we're not we're not gonna come for you guys for anything. We're gonna come. It's just gonna be retaliation at this yeah. at this point. So what I'm saying to you is this: if again, it's not even about like because nobody wants war. Nobody wants war. They just want you know the blood that was pledged. And if that's, you know, but if you never really in, was he? Yeah, I was. He, he was. Me in. I gave him my uh, broken bottle. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right. But, uh, yeah, Dre's saying he doesn't respect current Bondi, and he doesn't think they deserve the blood. So he's saying no, and that he left because he's a found he's basically an OG founder, and they have no right as, you know, people who just got in the club to say anything about his actions or what he does. I, no, if, I feel I that is uh, for I the members. Like, I'm bored. I don't, I don't like what we're doing. The man's good, but like, I just want something new. I, I don't like these people. That'd be different. Then I'd blood out. But the, the circumstances of why I left and the shit I had to deal with up until that point, that that's why I'm not accepting being blooded out. Because I don't think I'm in the wrong for leaving. No do one I, says it. No one says no, that you're wrong. If you feel the way that you feel, you should leave. But, like I said, it, for me, it's just, I'm just trying to see if there's anything that we can do to make it not messy. But if it, if this is your stance, then so be it. I mean, um, y'all wanna, y'all wanna shoot me. It's gonna get messy. Yeah, it's gonna get messy. And like, it, I, like I'll come down and I'll. I'll Dre, I'll, I'll knock hand. you out with some knuckle dusters right now. How's that? And we can We're call it done. Out? Yeah. <laughs> I still think you should keep your stance, Dre, but it's up to you. Like I said, as far as I'm concerned, Jeff is out. He's already he's he's paid his price. And so since you know, since that's what I Ed might, said. I might be willing for that later, at a later time. Okay. And fr from what I understand maybe, maybe if you guys can show that me leaving was was uh, not the right call. It's not about the call. Guys, no, no, I know, no, I, my personal call. Mm. Like, like I, I chose to leave for certain reasons, and if I was wrong for that, like, like if, if my if my concerns were wrong, can you guys show that they were? Then I'll come down. You can leave me out. That doesn't make sense because whether the the whether you feel you're right or wrong or someone is proving well, right or wrong. That's not gonna happen in 24 hours. That's irrelevant. Well, the that's 24 hours, happen. as far as I understand, are almost up. But that's not the point. At the beginning of the EU, they're up. The conversation so, happens at the beginning of the EU. Okay, so six hours. Yeah. Okay. So it's almost up. So. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right. And uh, percentage-wise, I was being a dick. Okay. And you were correct. All right, thank you. So what I'm saying, Dre, is regardless of your reason for leaving, it's blood in, blood out. 
right? So just, I'm just right. saying, that's, why that's not? So, so why not just blood out and be done with it, and we can all move on? Because, like I said, I don't, I don't think my blood is deserved for Vanda. I, I've had issues with command. I've had issues where I couldn't uh, do my role. Uh, the yeah. members disrespected me even though I put my life into it. Mm -hmm. They're trying to dethrone me while all that's happening. They're trying to speak behind my back about everything. I don't think those people deserve my blood. Now, if they can pull it together and actually show that, you know, they're re a respectable crew and they deserve my blood and they want to get the this chapter over with, then fine. But what does that look like? What does that look though, like for you, Jack? What does that mean? If they can get it together, what does that mean? When they can, well, I don't know. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie. I can't, I can't relay that and be like, well, he says when we, you know, look respectable again, then he'll give us the blood. That doesn't make sense. You know, just I'm just saying, coming for like if you don't have no, a can, solution, I, can I can't yeah, I offer know. it. You know. Yeah, I know. I, I said that without actually thinking about it. I know. If, if so I let's try like again. If what? If Bandai doesn't disrespect me anymore, then I will give my blood. You can punch me out with knuckle dusters, no bullets. If I feel like my disrespect from Bandai is squashed and we're on good terms, then I'm good. So, what are you looking for? An apology? I don't think it's even an apology. Mm-hmm. I don't know, maybe I'll have to think about it. And, you know, we can I can call you and we can talk about it later. Because I, I just woke up, so I'm pretty tired. I understand. Um, I'll probably be up for most of this storm. If, if any of that changes, I'll let you all know. But after the 24 hours, I can't do nothing. Oh, okay. I can. Yeah. Even so, even if it's three days from now or four or, or a week from now, if we can make a deal even then, that's that'd be fine. But even at this current crazy. moment, there is there is no way you can blood me out right now and have things over with. Okay. Even even though it's not your fault, it might not be all of Command's fault. But at this current, I'm moment, not Command at all. Like I, like I said, I'm just a, I'm I'm an OG, just trying know. to make shit. You know, trying to make shit work. I'm trying to avoid war with, you know, people who I've considered family for the longest time. I, and you know, I got my husband the... and people now are questioning how this is going to work. If I'm still in the club and Spencer's in a different club and now there's animosity and possible war, you know, oh, know. I'm trying to avoid. Happened. Sure, I did, too. But at the same time. If it can be avoided, I'd like to get it just done and out the way. But it, I, I can't make you all do anything. You want to keep your stance, keep your stance. I just want to be able to say that I did what I said I was going to do. I was going to have a conversation no, no, and Jeff, see what we could, we could do. Do you remember what I said after we stopped, uh, after we left Chris uh, when we were talking to her? No. Yeah, smoking. Smoking. <laughs> when when we finished talking to you, Chris, we went back into the house to grab uh, his stuff. And the first thing I said was, this feels bad because uh, Chris is probably going to get punished for this. We're just letting him oh, walk yeah. away. I mean, I mean, because I knew that you weren't going to get a, uh, a spot in command. Not when we talked. I'm just saying... Over the whole course, they're getting rid of me, Shiloh, and probably even more. And the fact that you've been gone for two weeks and they're crying about me being gone for a month that I couldn't even avoid mm -hmm. or change. I, I, I just knew from like right now that you're not going to get a command position. I don't care about that really as much as, you know, I thought about it. If it was, if it's going to be useful, then I'll take it. But at the same time. I don't give a shit about that. I just want my family to work. Um, and so if the jacket helps, it's been fine. And if not, so be it. It is what it is. But I'm not willing to give up on it yet. I just can't. I put no, too I much I put too much of my life 
into this club that this club has become my life and you, you know, know as much as i hate to see and it go not the reason they're having these issues either no not at all yeah. <laughs> so what i'm saying is because of that i'm gonna stay until i can't anymore they either have to take me out they have to take me out or the club has to actually die and people just have to disband i respect the fuck out of that this is because i couldn't do that chris like the emotional pull i could feel that in your voice the emotional pull was taking on you dealing with that i couldn't do that to myself anymore so i was just like a healthier path is just to do my own thing and then when dre said he would come like uh man it was just like that friends back together again like when i was first in bondi Mm -hmm. You know, and I have those vibes again of when I was building Bondi. Mm -hmm. and we, me and Dre were hanging out every day. I have those. I'm so, so good. I'm so happy mm -hmm. now. Well, you know? that's like, good. If, at the very end of it, I I want everyone involved or not involved to be happy to be here. Whether you're in the club or not, you should be happy to wake up. Okay. So yeah, if yeah. this is not the home for you anymore, fine. I have no ill will towards you for that. Like I said, but Bondi is my baby. Spencer and I had a conversation on that rooftop over there. And then we had another one over there on the track. And is that him pissing on the wall? Of course it is. Anyway, um over there, wow. Yeah, and that's that's how Bondi started. Period. And I from then I've put everything, everything into this organization, yeah, into this family. And you know, I, yeah. I understand that. That's so, the reason why I left is that I, I rearranged my whole life mm -hmm. in this club. And like I said, just, just for all of it to crumble apart because people want to vote in people they like as command instead of people who are suited for command. Mm -hmm. That's exactly where I was going. Edward made it into a democracy, which is fine, but like, I, I could see I could see the whole thing crumbling, and I didn't want to I didn't want to repair it again. It was too much. Uh, Jeff offered me this position, thought about it, and thought it would be uh, a good change. That and I need some space from Layla. Fair enough. Well, from what I understand, you've had nothing but space because she hasn't been around. But um, uh, exactly, but yet they don't want to take her out of enforcement. Another problem. See, okay. see how I'm road captain doing my job, and they want to take me mm -hmm. out. But Layla's an enforcer, never around the Billy. They want to keep her as enforcer because when she does enforce, like once a month, she actually enforces. Mm. All right, so uh, let's go back over there. All right. Uh, we gotta run. Yeah. They've been, they've been waiting patiently. Mm-hmm. God damn it, Steven. What did I do? <laughs> what do you always do? Fucking squat? Yeah, that's <laughs> Hey chat. <laughs> oh, hi. hi honey. Okay, first things first. Fucking Jared. I cannot believe he said that shit. <laughs> what? He just straight up said, "Oh, so how are we going to how are we going to handle this blooding out thing?" Jump. Just why would you say that? <laughs> Secondly, um they were like no dice like for me jeff has already you know done the thing but dre still had to you know do it he st sticks by his his stance he said maybe at some point he'll let me dust them but he's not taking a bullet and you know whatever so i don't know we may talk about we may have another conversation in a couple hours but um it is what it is right now so it's up to command if uh, nothing happens by next door. 
for by the end of this storm. You know what we're doing right now looks tremendously terrible. I don't give a fuck. You're my husband. And I'm not telling you anything that they're not going to tell you. Or that I'm not going to take back to, to them. I'm, I'm just saying, I, I, I really don't give a fuck because, like I've told you, again and again, and we both discussed that at the end of the day, you're what's most important to me. Mm -hmm. So, whatever happens, happens. I don't mm -hmm. care what they think, but I'm not telling you secrets. You're not telling me secrets. Nope. So. No secrets. Just, just facts. And like I said, they'll tell you the same thing. I will tell Jared and command the same thing. We're all good, okay? Yeah, I'm just going to rosy it up a little bit. <laughs> Don't move. We're going to get this right tonight, goddammit. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's like... Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Why are you walking Okay. Away? Okay. Keep 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 it going. Keep it going. <laughs> All right. Let's go back so we're not missing. Okay. Come on. <laughs> I got drugs to sell. You got a? Did you pay your vehicle fees? Mr. Rich Man over here, money bags. I did now. Awesome. Yep, 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 yep. All right. Did you get that money I gave to you? I did, thank you. Buy yourself something nice that's not on other people. Spend it on you for fuck's sake. What do you mean? I buy clothes all the time. I know that you're generous as fuck. I don't just <laughs> give away a whole ton of money. Anyways. Alright. So that's the thing, they don't, the, the, this whole voting thing about taking people out of command and replacing them. I'm missing my vape chat. Like, Layla's not in that running. And that's why we and I'm starting uh, to freak out. got rid of Jeff, and I heard that there are a lot of people talking about getting rid of me as well. Okay, I found it. Yeah, they want to change and command, you know. Can I can I say something that makes me look like a cunt, but I don't really care? I think that Cray as enforcer is possibly the worst decision in BBMC history. Well, the reason why we made that is that she is very assertive and she's not afraid to speak up her mind. We we're trying to hope she? that she would grow into her position. I mean, I love Cray. Look, I I tried to recruit her when we were like four people deep when I formed BBMC. I tried to recruit her, but for her to be enforcer of all things, like, you know, make her something, but I, yeah, I don't but know. If, if she actually did her job, she would be a good enforcer. But she doesn't. That, like I said, all it, right. it was more of a potential that never got fulfilled. We don't need to talk about that. We're no, I, yeah, no, that, yeah, that's fine. Concerned. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I'm yeah, sorry. Right. I'm sorry. Yeah, my bad. Sorry, guys. I, I just wanted to say that. My bad. I apologize. You're good, hon. You're good. Let's... All right. Well, we've said what needs to be said. Messages can go wherever they need to go. Uh, I'm sorry about being late, guys. I, I need to get gas, and I was in my head for a moment. You're good. Mm -hmm. So, so yeah, I didn't do anything here, right? No. No, no, no. You came here to talk on good grades. Wait, wait, wait. Are anything. we doing something? I thought no. we were meant to blow well, people out. Right? No. Yeah, we, we came out here because they wanted to blood me out. We came out here because I wanted to have a conversation about blooding out. Oh, get that. Okay. <laughs> Whether or not it happened, you know, was up to you all. So, you know, it's clearly not. So, you know, it is what it is. If you guys, you know, talk, want to talk later, that's fine. Like I said, after the time frame that Ed put forth, I can't do, you know, dick all. Mm. Yeah, 24 hours. hours. 24 hours, that's only happens. On what? On handing blood Jeff out. and Dre over to the Billy. To blood Dre out? We're gonna hand him to the Billy? No. That's what no. He wants. No, no, I'm saying that's what he's asking. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So we're supposed to parade 
Ray down there and put him on display for all this. That's that is that is the reason why I had this discussion to avoid something like that or you know it being even more messy. I was trying to make sure that if it was going to happen it's done clean, quiet, whatever, but it would be up to them, you know, depending on what I had to say. And it, like, you know, if it's no, it's no. Fuck it, you know, we do what we got to do on either side, right? Right, and, and Jared, if, if anything like that does happen, it's strictly business, nothing personal. Yeah, for sure. It's not personal, and it's not really, it's not against, if we do anything, or not we, but if Bondi makes a decision and it goes that way, it's not against Sinister. It's not a sinister thing. It's a, a Dre slash Jeff thing. Just squashing, yeah, We're just, just trying to squash down. that and just clean it up, you know? Jeff seems to have been out for a while because you didn't want to post things out there. I, I understand Edward, that. Like, as far as I'm concerned, <laughs> Edward said he was blooded out, and then Josh said the same thing. If that is the case, I personally have no issue with that. There are other members. There are other. Fuck the club. Yeah. That's what they said. What? No, 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 no. Listen. No, listen if, to what if, I'm if, saying. If no, if your two high command said that's done, stop letting the fucking monkey run the circus. Who are you I'm yelling at, Spencer? I'm yelling in general. Okay. This is the problem: is that you let the monkeys run the fucking circus. What did? What if did you? Josh, what did you hear me say? Oh my god, I need to. He heard me say, fuck what the members say. At the end of the day, if they say that that Jeff is blooded out, you're not listening. If, if Jeff, I'm sorry, if Josh and Ed both say that Jeff is blooded out, then Jeff is blooded out. And, you know, maybe that has to be a, a reinforced by the rest of command and, you know, me if necessary. But it is what it is. That still doesn't. Okay, so why are you shouting? Because Why are you said, mad? The rest of the club? And I said, "Fuck the rest of the club." Yeah, and I'm agreeing with you. Okay. Why are you letting the monkeys run the circus? If the point number is, one, I'm number not. two said it's fine, then it's done. Okay, That's so okay, so you're you're yelling at the air, babe, because we're all in agreement right here. <laughs> <laughs> yes, okay. I know more than you know. Yeah, I understand. The, major the majority of the club could overthrow the leaders if they really wanted to. They could. They could, but they won't. Yeah. Well, well, they are. I mean, they're kind of trying to, but it's. Yeah, like that's Edward the Josh, third, third so they're time. Gonna, they're definitely gonna, they're not gonna overthrow them. Well, that, but that's the thing, though. They voted them in. Why would they overthrow them? Yeah. Right. Jo so Josh they... keeps backpedaling on everything he's doing, causing more problems with the club, making my job. Okay, they're so what right. we're what we're gonna do? Because this is what we said we weren't gonna do is, you know, talk about oh, yeah, all that. So let's just let's just chill here. Like I said, my business is done. Um, like I said, unless you all want to, you know, talk later tonight, that's fine. But, um, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, okay. But yeah, no, we're good. Yeah, I just hope we can be friends in the future. I mean, the blooding out thing is kind of... A hundred percent. Even, even, like I said, this whole blooding out thing, if we go to war and whatnot, it's strictly business. I know you guys need to hunt me down and put me out. I understand that. And even, even sure if you guys don't end up... I mean, no you guys should be the ones starting the war. It and should. You guys threatened to start war. But you agreed to be blooded in, so it's yeah, it's your fault. Yeah, but but the but the people yeah. there don't deserve no to be blooded he's out. Saying he was blooded that's, in. That's that's my blood opinion. Yeah, it is. Yeah. But I spoke to Chris, and if I feel like I'm not being disrespected, and Bondi is what I think it should be, and they deserve my blood, I'll come down. You guys can blood me out with some brass knuckles. I don't know if you realize, but I'm still yeah. not blooded in at this point oh, wow. because of this weird shit. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I'm sure we all have business to take care of, so all right, Chris, let's uh, get some dinner in a little bit. And, uh, sure, honey. You know? Of course. Right, hell yeah. I'll uh, get some dinner and dinner. I'm busy, sorry. <laughs> Oh damn! <laughs> damn! Rejected. He's also spoken for. Rude. Hmm. Where'd you go? Good. Th okay.
love you too. Yeah, we did. Alright. Alright. Alright, Ben. Love you. Love you too. See ya. <laughs> I mean, it was basically what I said. I just wanted to see if if they'd be willing to let me just take them down real quick and and let it be done, or if there's any circumstance under which we could just have it over with without getting messy or going to war or anything like that. Then you know, it would be up to them, and I would be the one to do it, not current com not command not a regular patch but me specifically and they were like you know like as far as i'm concerned honestly jeff's out jeff's already blooded out um yeah and the other, most of the club didn't feel that way or it was kind of weird yeah um, maybe but at the same time ed said what ed said and that's yeah. kind of the problem right like one of the issues is then that he, then he right? yeah and that's exactly so I feel like if Josh and, and Ed have to stand on their on their word and you know sometimes it's just too bad you know members just have to deal with it unfortunately but he didn't feel that way so you know it's meant to be you know you don't have contact with the person ever again and that's just not Th that's not necessary. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, that's, that's what we kind of agreed on in the past. But it, just won't work out this it, it hasn't worked out before. Yeah. Otherwise, Roy wouldn't be here. <laughs> yeah. I mean, or Phil even. even. Kind of like, it, yeah, and that's still, you know, no, no, no. We uh, mid tsunami is when uh, we should probably. I mean, we could have it now. No, because simply because it's of hour. what it's two, uh, two hours, two hours. Yeah. So you know. Yeah, we can talk about that. We, we're alive. Everybody's fine. There's your update. Yeah, I'll just wait till we have an official meeting to talk. Okay. So everyone knows. There's no yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. 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 Okay. Is anybody cornering oh, anything eight. right now? Nope. And your stuff is in the mailbox. Fantastic. Thank you. I need to sell meth. Unfortunately, that did not go the way I would have liked. However, I cannot say that I am surprised. I cannot say that I did not expect that to happen. So, it is what it is. Chris stayed true to her word. And that, whose car is this? I need a meth car. Whatever, whatever. Sorry. So whatever is fine. All right. I just need four wheels and unlocked.
Is that a sickies? Got it. <laughs> Can you put it in the middle of the garage there? Thank you. The Ellie can perfectly fit through the gate right there. Beautiful. Can I get keys just in case? And then uh, I yeah. drop some stuff and lock it. Thank you. Can't I corner? Yeah, um, you want to come with me to tier one because that's where I have my uh, van. You bring your uh, news rumble over there to tier one. Bring your vent to your one, um, and then I'll do uh, your boxes. That's why, because it was locked. Okay, Durr. I'm just gonna wrap my bag over there. Okay. <gasps> a duh. It must be unlocked in order to corner. Du -du -du -du. Okay. Mask on. Let's go. Thank you. Could you uh, body and engine the HSP again, please, uh -huh. Jackson? Uh, yeah, one sec. Thank you. Your body that was. Oh, uh, actually, I think it just needs to be parked. I didn't park it. It probably just needs to be parked. You body and engine it because there's no hood or nothing. Okay, that's two. Uh, yeah, I body and engined it. I actually went across it before the race. It just needs to be parked though. Checking in.
Vaz, I came in sixth with your HSB. money can I have money you have money I gave all the money you motherfucker you a lying ass I had two hundred thousand dollars I gave you 50k I gave that's you a not, quarter of my money yes that's not all of it is it you still have the majority of your money what you want more okay you said you gave me fifty thousand dollars that gave me roughly fifty six thousand dollars so that's why I'm making Are money you right that now. Broke? After I paid bills, yeah. Oh my god. That's why I'm more money? Well, that's why I'm doing what I'm doing now, babe. I'm good. <laughs> so what's going on? Talk to me. As far as what? Yeah, I got a egg hunch, by the way, Let me know what's going on. Talk to me as fucking well, husband. Okay, but what do you mean? Like what the fuck happened when you're meeting? Did they not tell you what happened? I, I told I told you I gotta get my car fixed. I got a fucking dark red and an orange engine light. I'm at the tuner shop right now. Lord tuner shop of all places. But uh um, well, here to, I came here to paint my car and mm -hmm. then I realized it was fucked and they're like, No, we gotta have a meeting right now. I was like, For fuck's sakes, I wouldn't have you. That's fine. Listen, um but yeah, I, everything that I said up there is what happened, so no more information than that. <sighs> it's gonna get fucking messy, isn't it? Most likely. I have to go back to fucking Norway or some shit, I think. You don't have to go back to Norway. You stand I'm with your crew. You. I'm not gonna fight you either. You stand with your crew, I'll stand with mine. And if it comes down to, you know, pushing, then we just stay out. I thought I was your prime minister. You will always be my prime minister. Well, then come with me. No. Why? Because I'm your queen. Queen's and this is what I want. I don't want to leave Vonda. What do you want? A shithole club that's going in the fucking toilet? You know, you said you weren't going to do this, and you're doing it. Like, I I'm talking right. to you. Like I'm telling you, understand. you don't have to you understand. You told me where you go, uh, I go. I said nothing. I said that if we were talking about mayhem, I said if you go, I'll leave. But that's not the case. That's not the same. You guys need help. It's not the same thing. Time has passed, babe, and you made a decision to stay. I decided to stay. I want to stay. I don't want to go against you, darling. But you know, I need you to support me as much as I support you. You may not agree. I, I support you. You don't because you're, you're talking shit about what it is that I'm trying to do. So if you I support you more than anything, and you okay. haven't had support in a long time, that's why you gave up the white jacket. Mm-hmm. And that's why I'm trying to work to get it back. But that's not you the point. All right. The point is, I'm I here. I want to be here, and they have to shoot me to get me out of here. Okay. So. You know, I'm very I, willing to do that. So I just be good. But I haven't done anything to deserve it, okay. and I never will. So it's not about deserving it; it's about what they want. I just care about you, and it concerns me. I, I see a, a a shift happening, and I'm not saying come be with me. I don't care. I'll, I'll fucking come be with you and we'll be together and nothing else matters. I don't care. Mm -hmm. But I don't want you to fucking get hurt like I got hurt with what happened. And yeah, I did a little bit extra. Mm, well, little. A lot extra. Mm -hmm. Come on. But I don't want you to go through the same thing where they fucking push you out like, like they've done with other people. So whatever you want I, I support you I'm not going nowhere you're still my goddamn wife I'm still gonna lay with you every night and, and hold you and love you 
but I, I do not. I'm, I'm terrified as fuck to fight. Uh, you. You're terrified to fight me. We, we won't fight each other. It's not about me. I, I don't want my boys shooting you. I don't want your boys shooting me. I don't want that or either, girls. but it is what it is. At the end of the day, hun, if, you know, if we have to recuse ourselves from this, then so be it, but... You have been here like, right behind the okay. Bar and how's that gonna work? Um, like it makes sense? Been around the corner from me, seeing if Alright, I just... I don't know. I know what you need, bro. Thanks, brother. So. Uh, I fell down. Are, are you okay? Hey, what's up? I just paid. Whoa! Hey, Curtis. Yeah. <laughs> How's it going? I just paid six thousand dollars to fix my car. I don't know I'm why. I'm doing good. Just give me a second. Um, sorry, Curtis right. came over from Green. Give me a second. I'll, uh, no, you're busy. We're I'll good. see you later. We're good, honey. I'll talk to you later, okay? I love you. And he hung up. It's fine. What's up? What up? Let's check the Oh, I'm alright. How about you? Yeah, you do. Oh, right. could be better, but I could be a lot worse, so I'm chilling at the moment. Is no, the Bandai is good? Bandai is what Bandai is at the moment. We're still here. In my county, they're getting hurt. I heard that. Yeah. I heard whispers. They're bleeding. They're bleeding. They're bleeding. I heard the whispers. Yeah, I, I'm not sure how long it lasts. Yeah, apparently there's somebody, I, I can't remember what gang it is, but they're coming, taking oh, over. Oh, Legion. Le Legion. Legion. You can, you can come in. You can come in, you're good. Yeah, Le Legion fucking them up. Dang. But, <clears throat> I have a problem with that, but it's, it's a weird conversation problem. Uh, Okay. Gotcha. So like I think I think people like GSF mm -hmm. and by that offer a lot more than just shooting. How about that? Yeah, they Agreed. offer a lot more than that. Yeah. And people that take them over or about to take them over just offer shooting. It makes it so mad. Mm. It's yeah. disgusting. There it, it, it should be more to gang life than just war. It's not yes. that it's not let me put it this way. Uh, these cities are not meant for that. There are oh. others that are, and people who feel that all they can do is go to war, is yeah. they should move. I agree. There's I so agree. much more. I agree 100%. <laughs> I just came over to check off and say, how you doing? Like, hey, huh? I'm doing all right, doing okay. Here's a little bit of uh, weirdness right now, but uh, so far, I'm so far I'm dealing with it just fine. <laughs> Hopefully, it stays that way. Okay. But, uh, yeah, Spencer ended up leaving, and uh, he's in another club now. So there's a little bit of awkwardness for that. Not really so much for him. But the other people that also left, it's making it it's making it weird. Because if it was just him that left, and it, it was just it was just messy. It's just messy. So it makes it more awkward for me. But it is what it is, you know. I am not you going nowhere. You boss. You good? <laughs> uh, true, true. I handle my business as best I can. Yeah, yeah. Ever since I met you, you did it. No? Okay. Yeah, <laughs> doing it. Thank you. I I appreciate your vote of confidence. No, I think you can control the shit. Mm. No, I'm not command anymore, but we'll see. <laughs> you don't have to be. A
control. That's the thing. Think about it. You don't have to be command to control. This is yeah. very true. I was a shadow for a long time. Yeah, so. you don't have to be command control. Mm. If your voice speaks true, everyone wants to follow the righteous way. Not the righteous way. It's not like speaking like God. Everyone wants to follow the person that speaks powerful enough. To, you do that, so you don't have to be control. You don't have to be mm. what prime minister. Mm. You just speak, and they, if they want to follow you, they're gonna follow you. They want to you, give you back. Position, position. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good voice. Is more powerful than position. Mm, that's true. Every president that sits around every country is just a figurehead for the people that around him that speak that real thing. So, yeah, mm. right? Mm, that's You've been true. doing it? So, you, you've been puppet mastering everybody, so. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm kidding. I was going to say, if that was. But, you know, you, but you've been controlling them. I mean, I, I think their bond lines are here because you've done it. Mm. Why not? Yeah. I'm not going anywhere. So? Don't. As long I don't as think you should. I don't think I should either. As long as there's a Bondi, there will be Christina in it, in a jacket. So, regardless of what color it is. Let's come on and stay in the sun. One second. I'm sorry, Mr. John. On the beach, just First of all, I'm, I'm going to want to have some um, situations in East, East County. Where is so, mm -hmm. I know. I think I'm going to do some bindings over here. Just pulled up. Yeah. Oh, why did he tell you? Yeah. Yeah. What? I got my, pass I got my passport for oh, well, so. You got what? My passport is there. <gasps> Did you really? Yeah. Oh, shit. I just thought. I'll go there right now. Well, good for you. But I, I don't. I, I can't leave green because my, my all my people are there. Mm -hmm. And I like, to, I like to come over here because the people are here. Mm -hmm. white and blue so I want to do something different in every county. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sure. So he might be scouting around. I'm gonna run around. Oh, I think it's white and blue. It's James Dean. Uh, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm stealthy. Yeah. So I'm sure what I want to do. Well, I mean, you should at least go and, and check it out. You went through everything. To... I did. I, I did. I, I'm scared. Shit. That's fair yeah. enough. To be honest, I'm scared. Shit. Uh, honestly, so am I, because the reason that I uh, came to Orange was to just kind of get a feel for things and all of that, so that I could go there. And then eventually, I was too chicken to even do the paperwork. And then, Why? but then, but then mm. also, I just I built so much, you know, already. I just I didn't I don't have you ever submitted any paperwork? Nope. <laughs> Because at this point, I don't even care I anymore. Think, I, I think I think you're in. And at least at this point. R respectfully? No mm -hmm. Respectfully? I think, I think you're an asshole. Respectfully what? I think you're an asshole. Respectfully, I think you are too. But yeah. Yeah. So okay. it's fine. You know but. Yeah. <laughs> No, I mean, I'm mean, i I'm, I'm okay know. with that. I love you too. I'm, I'm fine with being an asshole, but, but I'm happy here. Okay, so and I do what, spend you know time you know in other what, places. You know I just worse? you know what's worse mm. because you actually make me I'm more of an asshole than you are. You know why? A hundred percent. Because I have that passport mm -hmm. and I should be over there. And I'm such a pussy. I'm over here. Okay. <laughs> so you know what? I'm more of an asshole. Than right. You ever. So yeah. yeah. All right. I'm such a, <laughs> I will see that nah, I would never say that about you, but no, since you said it first, no, I'll, I'll do it. 
Like, I could do everything, but it's just... It's, I don't know. Bro. It's hard to start from scratch. That's why yeah. I don't spend that too much um, time in green, because it's just hard to start over, you know? You start over twice. Just right. Time. Right, right. Like, I just... I've built so much here to, you know... Mm. It's fine to go visit places, but it's too much work for me to just go over there sometimes, you know, because this is this what? is home. <laughs> you always say that, but you keep coming back to see me. Yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. This place is good. Are you good now? Is this better? Um, yeah, I'd say so. All right. It's it's gotten better. It's gotten weirder because of how things changed across the cities, but. That's just how it goes. You know, people are frustrated because you know things are changing and they don't know how to how to cope with it. But as far oh, as me Earth, and, and the club Green, is concerned, we're fine. <laughs> Green County. Oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What? Selling drugs? That's illegal. So the, um, <laughs> the biggest GG member over there. Hmm. Well, the leader, good yeah, man. And then the other leader <laughs> went, to, <laughs> went to our camp, with the other camp. Hmm. So they're in shambles. Yeah. Um, everyone's in shambles. It's like, don't just do anything over there. Mm -hmm. That is unfortunate. And the last couple times I went over there, it was just quiet and weird. It was okay, eerie. Quiet weird. And then <sighs> now, um, Legion's trying to destroy BBMC. Mm -hmm. Destroy. And all of a sudden, SSMC woke up mm -hmm. to BBMC and defend BBMC from Legion. Which is super weird. Yeah. It's just so bad. Yeah. It's just these counties is just getting so weird. Yeah, I think it's it's in the air that you know the time. I think I think, I think we're all tired. Of I think we're all yeah, tired. Yeah. The tired and there's we're a all bored. we all know that you know life here is not forever. And yeah, I we're think all tired and bored. We all want to we all go away a little bit. I think yeah. we all need to get something to revitalize us to come back. Yeah. The banks didn't do that. So no, they definitely else. did not. <laughs> the banks did not. Gang sprays did not. It was. It made things gang, worse. Gang sprays fucking destroyed everything. Yeah. Literally, gang sprays destroyed everything. Yeah, it was that was that was probably Gangster like tags just for the for the everything. sake for the sake of having tags so that we have something to do to, you know, represent ourselves, that's fine. But when they changed it so that they actually mean something else, that 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 threw so much off. I so much. Th there needs to be a funnel of money thrown away. Yeah. Mm. Gang spray is supposed to do a funnel of money to be done away, but the other thing that that thing did mm. was dumb as fuck. Yeah. That destroyed everything. Nobody wants to do anything. Yeah, it's it's crazy. It's like, absolutely crazy. Gangs need to throw away all the money because you guys have so, not you, mm. but I mean we're all right. Gangs have so much money. Mm -hmm. throw away. You need to throw away. I mean, we need something to do with it. There's only so many yeah. cars that a person yeah. needs or that a group of people need. But this like, whole... I'm, I'm, I'm so sad seeing BBMC almost literally destroyed my county. Yeah, that's they're unfortunate. Close they're, they're close to it. They, they've been destroyed by a shitty, ugly-looking gang called Legion. <laughs> Not, not, not by like Ballas mm -hmm. or GSF. You know why? Because Ballas and GSF have a turf and they stay in it, and they mind their business. Oh, guess what? Mm. Guess what? Guess what? Mm. You ready? 
I'm listening. GSF is destroyed. There's no GSF in my county either. Mine either. GSF is gone. They're destroyed by Spinellos. So I, we, we, we're about to lose two of the main staples of fucking games. Well, to be fair, in this county, GSF is one of those that is that resurge every once in a while. I think this, since I've moved here, it's probably the third iteration of GSF. Um, GSF, won't, GSF won't resurge. Yeah. Um, they won't. They're done. Same with the the Vogels, but the Vogels are holding strong. Pretty oh, good no, right now. No, no, no. Here. Resurge like three times. And mm -hmm. they hold strong. Yeah. Um, hey Chris, do you need points? Yes, desperately. Um, right, and the thing is, like, besides freaking what bowl cut in the loss, BBMC has been consistent. The I would say that we were the we've been the longest standing game or MC in the city. Um. And that's why I don't want to lose the county. That sucks. Thank you. Um, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Like, Legion's about to really fucking rip that shit apart. Mm. We have. Is it Northside so Legion is a gang here? And they're starting to move. You have Legion in. here? Yeah, Northside Legion. They actually are moving into my neighborhood where the mansion is and they're tagging the outside oh. of their houses Curtis how trashy is that no <laughs> so the legion of my blood mm. are hitting that hotel they, you see mm -hmm. right in front of uh, and they're just but before they got it before they had a spray they just yeah, I, I like what they mean they just try to be able to like but not in a classy way. Right. You know you shoot and say whatever. It was disgusting. Over and over and over and over. It was disgusting. Mm. I mean, government employees had to come and rob and say stop. We've had situations like that where the government and had to then, come in and chill. Yeah, then once they got their flag and sprays, mm -hmm. all they was doing crazy again and did it all over again. And, and then... Government points that have stopped. Mm -hmm. But they're still <laughs> they want to go down. The chat. There. It's disgusting. Yeah. I I don't know. I, it, it I don't good. believe in. I don't believe in. Kicking whole thing out of the territory. Mm, I don't necessarily either. It really does depend here. on, like there, there, there is. Well, here's the thing, at least here. Give the thing is, it's so. It's tricky because in the city you only have so many areas that you can do certain things, right? And there's so many people, and there's only so much property. So I understand if you're fighting for a turf or whatever, it, it's fine. It's a thing that's gonna happen. But like, if you own all the property. Like, what are you going to do? People have said that we own every building in here. Every house that can be owned is owned, plus Big White. I own that. So there's, like, how are you going to push us out? We're going to still wake up every day and clap. It, what do you think is going to happen? Yeah. I'm just about to see you guys know that over here. Yeah, we're, we're, we're managing. Yeah. Are you going to I need a mod. Mod Are check. Are you going to the other county? Say it again. Are you going to the other county? No. You going to figure that shit out? Nah. Not at this stage in the game. Maybe next time around, but not now. Okay. Oh wait, that's right. My mod, my mod is in the city right now. <laughs> okay. Uh, 
hang on one second. We're just gonna, just gonna, we're just gonna, yeah, we're gonna just ban them. Yeah, okay. What happened? So these bodies don't fuck around. I have a little roof over here. Oh yeah. Yeah. He's watching out, making sure everything's good, making sure the cops don't come down. If they do, then I got time. The minute I touch you, he will shoot the shit out of me. I know. He's been watching me for a fight. He's waiting for me. Yeah. Just be careful. Don't have a muscle spasm. They protect uh, the queen. <laughs> I know you're the queen. That's why I know that. I never touched you. I've known you for like a year now. We're good. Pretty much. Yeah? I know. What this Bondi doesn't know is that you actually used to be security for me anyway. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> actually. Yeah, sure did. Yeah. Sure did. I'm just if you good. Um, I'm probably gonna be. Okay. All right. If you get, if you do anything, just let me know. Email me. Be fun. Anything fun to do. Home. Okay. The thing I want to do is, uh, it's gonna be weird to say, but I want to get experience a different thing. Mm hmm. Because you know what I've done. Yeah. So I want to do different other things. Okay. I get to you. To round the, to round up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because before I go into that place, I, I hear you. But I don't want to use any money, you know. It's, mm -hmm. I'm down to do whatever. I don't give a fuck. Especially this place. Oh, this mm -hmm. Urban County. I'm down to do whatever. You're down for whatever. <laughs> yeah, I don't give a fucking here. Okay. Urban County, I'm a little bit more reserved. Mm. Here, don't give a fuck. Fuck it. I'm going to jail yeah, today. That's the motto, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to jail today. You ain't I'm been to jail with... yet. Here, yeah, I've been to jail. But how long? Oh, like. 30 months? Mm. Nothing. Hello? Hey, baby. Hi, hon. You want to go have some dinner? Hey, hon. Sure, sure. I uh, just want to finish. Oh, sure. Get I'll rid of these uh, bags, and I can meet you if you uh, want. I'll hug you, too. Where are you? I'm at the Billy. Yeah, yeah, Billy? Yes. Billy, huh? uh, money, money. Shut up, Curtis. Okay, so, um, I don't know. Where do you want to eat? No, I'm just... Do you want to go to the shop? Out. Uh, you want to meet at the shop? Yeah, we can go to the shop. You want to get some dinner and hang out and just be us? Yeah, sure. I'll change. Yeah? What do you change? How okay. fancy are we going? How fit? I mean, it's a magic shop, babe. You don't have to be Hold fancy. Hold on. People are yelling. People are yelling. What do you want to do? Hello? Mm-hmm. Hi. Hi. Where can I meet you? I'm, 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 I'm here at uh, White Widow Farm, so... You're at the farm. Is Maldini's open? I have no fucking idea. You want to come paint my car and get some dinner and hang out together? Sure. Yeah? yeah. Where you want to meet, baby? We already... Okay, I feel like we're talking in circles. I know, I, <laughs> no, I heard you, but people were yelling, so I didn't get to hear you. You heard me, but you didn't hear me. No, I heard you talking, but there's a bunch oh. of other people yelling. I was saying we could meet at the shop. We can eat there. Or um, we can go to um, Maldini's or something. No, I'll meet you at the shop. How's that sound? That's fine. Hold on. Let's hang, let's hang out. Let's be me yeah. and you. Is that okay? Yes, of course. Hi, right, baby. I'm going to head down there right now. All right. I'll or just be... Do you need time? Uh, yeah, I'll be... A few minutes. I'm almost done. All right. Well, uh, maybe I'll go shine my car up, make it look nice. For my wife. Go shopping. Get, get some more clothes. No. <laughs> get some more clothes. 
<laughs> no, you're gonna come with me. But anyways. Okay. I'll see you soon, okay? Alright, love you. Love you too, baby. Alright. Bye. <clears throat> My husband wants to go have dinner. At 11 in the afternoon. That's fine. My husband and I are going to have dinner. That's what he was calling for. We you, you you know, okay. you know, okay, huh? Oh, you're on the phone. <laughs> My husband is hung up with What? You call Spencer? <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> oh my gosh, you probably hadn't saved your number. <laughs> Awkward. You probably did say my number. I know you. I know you and your wife. We met a, a while ago. Several times. Several times. You <laughs> asked me to, you know, me and my a long time ago. I just want to know if you want to have dinner with me. <laughs> oh my god. I cannot with these two. <laughs> yes. Maybe. Uh huh. Hold on. Angry local running from the back of the belly in. Alright. Listen, they're pushing the fuck bill along. When? Get out of there. Okay. All right. All right. Do, don't. Okay. Use what I'm telling you. Okay. Okay. Get get the fuck out of there and let's meet at the shop. All do right. not. I don't want to be okay. part of this. You All don't right. want to be part of this. All right. Please. All right. I'm going right now. Okay. I'll meet All you right. at the shop. All right. All right. I love you. I I'm not gonna fucking fight you, and I'm not gonna let these people hurt you. All right. See you right. soon. See you something corner, right? Bye. Bye. Who wants food? Huh? Uh, I gotta go to the sponsor. Watch out. Yeah, we'll Alright, corner's clear. I'm gonna go have dinner with my husband. Have a good day. Good yeah. night. Good night. What's up? I will. I will. See you later. Tell him, tell him I actually know him. I will. Yeah. I will. <laughs> okay, so Alright, take care. Yeah. Ow. Oh, my bike is broken, isn't it? Of course.
some car that looks like Max um, on uh, Bay City. Looked like they were slow rolling. I don't know. Hello. Hello? Like Machiavelli or Mac? Uh, Machiavelli. Oh, my yeah, my bike broke. I gotta go. I'm um, trying to go to tier two. Tell them to pay the dollars. Are you gonna fucking tell them what I said? What do you mean? I'm already out. Huh? I'm, oh, I'm at the fucking. Well, I, just, I just said that I was gonna go have dinner I don't with know. you. The LFA just went behind tennis right. sports, like shooting a Let's keep yeah. this even, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Oh, they might be Seems with the side. We're just right. making sure. Okay. Bye. Bye. We get on little light. They just turned and went further up Bay City. Yeah, they might be with Seaside. Okay. Mm Crazy, Seaside can't even fight their own wars. It might be the MT for Seaside. Enders, MT took out over 10 Seaside members and MT members. Uh, who's behind, uh, who's going by the tennis courts? Yeah, I, I want to see right. if they were still back here or something like that. Alright. I saw blue for a second by blue building, so... Coming back. Alright. I mean, I'm not, but the car is. <laughs> Alright. went to burger shot Yes, babe. Where are you? I'm on the way. Do not. I'm. I'm going. I'm. I'm Don't almost to you. Please. What do you mean? I'm almost to the shop. I told you I had Just to run to sure. the. I had to run to tier two to get a car because my bike broke. So. All right. I'm trying not to be part of this. My club knows I don't want to be part of this, so I just want you to be the same. Did you tell them? I told them I was having dinner with you. Okay. okay. I'm just making sure because I'm being fair. I want you to be fair. Mm -hmm. Everyone. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> That's my wife. <laughs> Hello. Who put that fire extinguisher there? So weird. Yeah, so weird. Hi. Hey. How you doing? I'm all right. How are you? You look great. Thank you. I'm doing fine. Imagine if everyone else was like us. <laughs> oh, 
have shit. This door is open, mm. open. Mm. <sighs> okay. Do you want... What do you want? You know what? I got you. I got you. I'll... I would love something to eat. No. Something to eat. Okay. Well, let me just... Besides you. Oh, honey. <laughs> what happened? What happened? Oh, you hate that. Mm. <laughs> I should have changed. I'm gonna be working. Wait, you're doing work? I mean, I'm making food. <laughs> How are you gonna go hang out? Well, you said you wanted to eat. I want to eat. Okay. You, you here and then go hang out. Okay. Okay. Well. Have fun. Okay. Well. Silly things. All right. Well, let's go and do that then. Just. Okay. just no! I just told you I was gonna make food and you're telling me you didn't want to eat the food from no, here. I, I need food, woman. Oh I my god, food. you're a what, what what am I supposed to do with you? <laughs> I don't know. That's up to you. You married my ass. I definitely did. Holy shit, I've seen an ass that I've married right now. Alright, alright. Are you on radio typing? It's always fucking blind. I mean, you don't have to drink it. It's weird. Well, then don't drink it. It's it fine. So bad. Then don't drink it. <laughs> I don't have to drink it. I just get the appeal. Well, you don't need to have the appeal to understand that some people like it. A lot of people don't like beer. That tastes weird. Drink my fucking beer. I have not. Yeah, you have. I drink my own beer. Thank you very much. Only because you gave it to me. I can buy my own beer. My beer is your beer. Exactly, so why are you making a big thing out of it? Your car or mine? Uh, you want to go paint my car with me? Mm, not particularly, but uh, I do want to... I do want to change, honestly. Where we, okay, tell me what we can do. Well, let's go to the house. I have food. Yeah. Alright, I'll meet you there, baby. Okay. You look so pretty, by the way. Thank you. With your smashed window. <laughs> I don't know what <laughs> you're talking about. My window's not smashed. I, oh, I didn't say anything. Not in my eyes. Okay, bye.
Jonathan. Hey, have I showed you my new suit? For the shop. I'm a floor manager. <laughs> I gotta dress the part. A floor manager? Mm hmm. That's serious stuff. It is. Well, I'm a serious person. Very, very important. It's not really. It's not really funny. It's unfortunate, but you know, it is what it is. Let me see. What shall I wear? Hmm. How about that? That's alright. You still have this outfit? No. I How dare you? Why did you get rid of it? We bought it so that we could be matching. Hey, chat. Oh, we said that we need to go shopping. You need to go shopping. Yeah, you do look great, but you need more clothes. Why you? Why do you have to keep pushing an issue? The horse is dead, babe. Quit kicking it. Well, why do you love a dead horse? Here? All right, whatever. You keep saying you're not gonna push me. You're not gonna, you know. You said you support me. Just do it. <laughs> I support you. What I have. <laughs> Do you have, like, a shirt? Oh, okay, there you go. Oh, well then, if you're gonna do that, hold on. No, I'm not doing this. Wait! <laughs> Puppy, you said you wanted to go do fun stuff. Why do I confuse you? Spencer, I don't want to be rivals. I'd like for us to be allies. I don't want to fight you. Ever. I hate fighting you. I hate the idea of just arguing with you. And that's why I'm going to try and end this conversation one more time. You said you weren't going to try and push me. You said you were going to support me. So let's leave it at that. If I'm Bondi, period. I don't care. I don't care. The ship I goes down. If you, get fucking shot because you're, but you don't have to watch me get shot. I'm not getting shot right now. Yeah, because I told them. I said I'm taking my wife out of the situation. Then go clap. Okay. I made this choice. Okay. So then, what's the problem? The problem is, is that you're fucking dying for people that you don't give a fuck about. Anything. I'm not dying at all. I'm with my husband. I thought we were going to go, you know, go do stuff. We're going to do stuff, but I just don't understand. We don't have to understand. Why? Because, Why because, Spencer, I put too much time, energy, blood, sweat, and tears into this club. That's for you. To Yeah, of course you did. Of course you did. Like, you know... You said that you couldn't deal, you didn't want to deal, and it, it is what it is, babe. You did what you did, you said what you said, and you made your choice. I didn't make that choice. I didn't make That's for you. Either. Pick that up, please.
No, you don't. No, you don't have to shoot me, and I don't have to shoot you. So what's the fucking problem? Like, you just fuck everything, you just go and die, and that's it? Everything else just doesn't matter? That's the way what do you mean, matter. everything else? Who said that? You matter. Okay, you, okay, so let me ask you a question, sweetheart. Why do I always have to follow you? Why do you, I am still with you. I'm not leaving you. you said yourself. Okay, you you're oh, can you listen? I said I will be with you through whatever. I did say that when we were thinking about going to mayhem. I did say that, but I thought about it just like you thought about it. I didn't want to leave Bondi. You didn't want to either. And then it ended up happening the way it happened. I still don't want to leave Bondi. I never did. Now, if this is going to come between us, then that's something that we both have to think about. But I don't want that. I want us to work wherever. Like, I support you being in Sinister Souls. I support you leaving to do what's right for you. Why can't you accept that I want to stay and that's what's right for me? Because you choose Bondi over me. I don't choose Sinister Souls over you. I didn't choose Bondi over you. You did. No, you I did. didn't. No, I didn't. And no, I haven't. So let's both give them our fucking jackets right now and just be us. How's that sound? You want to be a civilian? I don't give a fuck. I'm You're not lying. Gonna you. I, I'm not going to do the, No. So I'm don't fight lying. me. How do I help that? I had to literally tell these people, let me talk to my wife and pull her away. Because they are literally right now shooting people. Exactly. So we're not fighting each other. What is the problem? So this is what I have to do every time? No. So, what? How about we, how about this, babe? How about we keep club stuff, club stuff? And not let it ever be personal. It's never personal. Okay, so, but you're I, making it personal. It's not about being personal. But I'm gonna tell you everything because you're my fucking wife. You're my soulmate. You're my soul bond. And everything I ever have, I'm gonna tell you. No matter what. Whether I don't wanna know. Your souls. I don't, I don't want inside information on your club's inner workings. And I'm not gonna share that with you either. And I think that's something that we can agree on without a problem. So we'll just be separate. When it comes to somebody. when it comes to the club stuff, like the business of the club, yeah. If it's if it's, you know, privileged information then that nobody should have, then so be it. We can still exist with each other as, you know, Spencer and Chris. I, I see wait no, I see where you Do you still want to so go out? I, no, I built something. And you, 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 you built it. And no, and you brought me on. in. You brought me in, honey. You started Bondi for sure, but we and built it. We built it together. It doesn't mean shit. I, I'm out of the club. You're a fucking patchwork. None of that means a fucking thing anymore. Okay. At all. I don't want to talk. I don't. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Do you want to go do something or no? Because I don't want to have this conversation anymore. We are either going to be husband and wife right now, or we're going to be, you know, club members right now. What do you want? You said let's just be us, right? I just want you. Okay. Well then. Fuck. I'll, I'll throw this jacket in the fucking garbage right now. You don't need to you throw it in the garbage. Way. You know. You're not willing to do the fucking same. Your yeah. died. That that's the oath identity. that I, that's the oath that I gave you. Yeah, yeah. Not me. But are you gonna give up? If I said right now, let's give up these patches, both of us, give up that patch on your back. I'll give up mine, and let's be together. Are you gonna give up Bondi? No, you won't. No. And I know but I'm not won't. giving you up either. <laughs> so it's not the same. 
Take your vest off. This club more than I fucking do. Okay, that's my fault. I, you love the club more than your own fucking husband. I don't so love fuck. the. I do not love the club more than I love you. But you know what? I'm a grown ass woman, and I can make my own decisions. And I feel like make your own I I did make my decision, and you still give me shit about it. Why can't you just accept it? I get that you're hurt by the club. I get that it's not the same. I get that it's not what we started out as in the beginning. I don't give but a I fuck about that. okay. So if you don't give a fuck about it, then I fucking fuck let me you. then let me do it. You don't, don't give a fuck. You don't. Love. You don't. You That's don't give a fuck about, about me as long as it has. To, as long as I do what you want me to do. Fuck that, Spencer. I'm out. I'm gone. I'm going back. No, you're not. Why are you doing this? Chris, do not. Please, do not drive away and be that fucking chick. Fuck the door. Chris, for what? fuck's sakes. Why, why are you deciding that this whole bullshit with the club, with, with Josh and Dre and Jeff, is more important than our fucking marriage? I don't. I don't. You think it, it is. is. No, you think it is. That's not me. That's because you. Because you don't fucking... Cause I, because what? I make a choice that's different than yours. That means I care about it more than you. I'm not are you that? You are you to that? Leave the fucking club. I'm oh, really? Because that's, that's what I fuck it sounds like. No, I'm telling you that me and you are the most important fucking thing. We're soul binded. And that's yeah, one. and that's not going to change. Don't fucking see that. I do see that. The thing is, Spencer, no matter where you are, no matter where I am, that is always going to be a fact. And you think that just because of that, that that means that we can't have different parts of our life and still be together? When it comes to us fighting each other, we're I don't not. Fuck with that. This That's is not us fighting right each other. Now. You're talking about the clubs are fighting You're each fighting other. Right now. No, you motherfucker, you are fighting me. Your car and left I'm about to do it now, actually, because you're not listening and you refuse to listen. So fuck it. I'm gonna go back to the billabong and I'm gonna shoot if no, I need to not. shoot. No, you're not. Do not. fucking talk like why i i tried to talk to you spencer and you, you keep telling me that i'm feel like the club is more important than me than us which is bullshit i'm telling you i think that we can make it work and you're saying oh well you know you're talking shit How about the club and stuff because the people i'm trying to be with are shooting the people you're with right now that is why you're here i took you away from really you're, you're really gonna do that chris fuck out of my car Don't give me shit leave me just quit <laughs> what why are you fucking being this way honey i didn't start this argument you did i didn't i'm, start I'm choosing i'm, I'm to choosing to talk to you no you're not trying you to talk to me away. you're trying to argue with me and you will not let it go i'm trying to be with my husband and you're trying to make it seem like i'm choosing something over you and that's bullshit spencer i'm going to benny's to well, fix my goddamn door and i will be right back no you won't don't tell me what the fuck i will and won't do i said what i'm going to do and i'm going to do it why are you doing this like Cause I need to blow off some steam before I actually dust you in the fucking face. Well, then dust me in the face. I'll just fucking die. I don't give a shit. Fuck this club. I'm not dealing with that. <laughs> I'm not dealing with that. <laughs> so I gotta go to the bank.
Spencer Angie Chris Angie like we were fine it is unfortunate that um, Spencer thinks that way like why, why am I here um, because they can make it work there are people in different clubs slash gangs that you know are married and they have their relationships and it works out just fine um, and he feels that because the club did hit him wrong that Chris should just follow suit and she she had a long think about that and decided that that's not what she wanted to do and as much as they are connected and they have their bond she's she's still committed to what they built together and making it better Yeah. Where are you at? I'm at the house still. Where? Yeah. In the living room. Stand up. Hello. Hi. <sighs> Honey. This is always going to be a thing. I don't want it to be a thing that breaks us. Okay? Okay. We can make this work. I know you may not understand and you don't like it and you want me to like be by your side at all times, but it's okay for us to do things not together and still be together. can make it work okay that's fine forever in a day and exactly. where you go I go doesn't mean anything that's fine forever and a day does not mean that we can't belong to different clubs okay shooting for right now honestly what I'm shooting for I'm just shoot, I just want us to get along baby yep, I, I get along I with you just fine oh, so you say but you're the one that's giving me the hard time because everything is literally everything is more important than me and that's everything the, is not the, the more important than you why do you feel that way Spencer everything's because more important than you I literally 
this whole my new club was coming here and clap you and I drag you out of it. Okay, I and said nothing. You could have and you did, and I appreciate that. And I came running as soon as you did, right? I could have said, and nah, fuck that. If they're coming to clap, I'm clapping, right? I could have said that, but I didn't. I wanted to be with you. It doesn't matter at the end. It does. Because this shithole club, bunch of fucking people destroying the club that you and I built, you want to stand here and die on that fucking ledge. And that's up to you. That is the, the hill you're willing to die on. That's up to you. But it's not the right hill. It's fucking crazy. I, I don't get it. I, I don't understand why you're so fucking loyal. For people that were not loyal to you. You got stabbed in the back the day I made you fucking PM. Stabbed yeah, in the back. Yeah, yeah. You know who? And, by and your back. president. Your president stabbed yeah. me in the back. And you're following him. So, really, what's it about? Okay. So then, down the rock and road, Machiavelli and these other people stabbed you in the back, too. They and left. That's how you lost your fucking white jacket. I didn't lose yeah. my white jacket. I handed it in. I, nobody was trying to push me out. I'm not going to win this fucking conversation. It obviously. shouldn't be about winning or losing, honey. That's the problem. We're not at odds. We are not against one another. I'm not against you, Spencer. I'm for you. I said you want to join Sinister. Who was with you at the fucking courthouse? Who called HOA so that you could get yourself set up and established? That was me. None of that matters because oh, okay. apparently what I did doesn't fucking matter. That's, that's the way it is. But you want to fucking die on this Bondi Hill with this shithole club? That's up to you. You want to fucking die with what Edward says when he shows up once a month? Go ahead. I don't get it. I, I really don't. Like, it's so fucking frustrating. I'm trying to be with you. I'm trying to hang out with you. And Same. And you started this. You brought it up. I wanted to yeah, hang out I'm with you. This. I wanted to eat and hang out and do stuff. And what you wanted to do was have a conversation and talk shit. And and I didn't I didn't do that. You did that. I don't know why you did that. Yeah, I did that because I pulled you away because I knew people were going to the billabong to fucking shoot people. Okay. And I didn't want you to get fucking shot. Okay, fine. Uh, great. The point I'm making, darling, is once you did that, you didn't want us to fight. You didn't want me to get shot at. I don't want you getting shot. So now we're here both together not getting shot and we're still fighting, which is what you say you wanted to avoid. So I don't understand. I don't understand either because you're willing to die on this fucking hill, which I don't get. Doesn't matter no. if you get it, it or not. Matter. Do you get me? I get you. That that's fine, but whatever. I I, I really don't fucking get it at all. I never will. And it is what it is. I I thought that. You know, my wife would be with me no matter what. I'm not saying I'm still for souls, you. But at the end of the day, you're on on this Bondi shit for some fucking reason. I don't get it. I, I really don't. Why? W what the fuck has Bondi done for you recently? What making you feel that good that this is where you want to be? Because I still I... believe that things can get better. <laughs> up to you that, that's your opinion it is my but opinion and it's my goal to make to try to make it better and if it doesn't work then it doesn't work but I'm willing to try they're just gonna talk shit about you and push you out too like they do with everything else they have to have a reason to blood me out do they sure do they have to have a fucking reason they really? do yes they do okay what, what's the reason why I got pushed out? Give me that. You didn't get pushed out. You probably would have, but I will tell you this. Because you um, are doing what you, you, you do what you do now. You're talking shit about the club that you say that you built and you love and all these people. And you, and you, you know, you're bad-mouthing the club in the club. So what do you, what do you think? Me, Dre, and Jeff decided to try and make a club 
be what it used to be. And all these fucking Andes decided that it wasn't fucking good enough. That's up to you. But if this is what you want to die on this hill, I, I don't fucking get it. It confuses the shit out of me. Honestly. Like, uh, you of all people. It confuses the fucking shit out of me. I think I'm ready to go to bed. Yeah, good luck with that. I, I don't fucking get it. I, I really don't. Done nothing but fucking support you and, and care for you. And, and really? I'm just gonna walk? I said walk. I'm ready for bed. Yeah, you can say whatever you want, but talk to me. For I've fuck's been. Sakes, like, there's no point in talking to you like this, Spencer, because there you're is not. A point. No, it's not because you will not listen. You refuse. You refuse to just listening. let it. No, you you're not listening. You're with me, no matter what. I'm for you, no matter what, Spencer. When, like I said, when you decided that you were gonna leave, hand in your jacket, and start sinister stoles, what did I do? I, I was. I jack shit. You. I was forced out. Nobody told you that you had to give up shit. But the point no, that I make I is whether Jack the hello, said, are you going to listen to me or not? All right. You chose to give up your jacket rather than wait for them to take it from you. Okay, is that a fair statement? So yes or no? I get hello. Yes, okay. Fair. Yes, fair. Okay, stop. Let me continue. That having been said, once you did all of that, you. You know, we went out, we had a conversation, you had a talk with Jeff, you said, fuck it, I'll start Sinister Stoles right now. And what did I do? Did I not support you? No, you supported Bondi. No, I supported you. I went with you to the courthouse to find a turf. I was looking at turf maps trying to see where would be a good place for you to go. I'm trying to think about how we can raise money so that you can get something established. And I am the one that called HOA so that you could have a meeting so that you could get help. Right? So why are you fighting me? I'm not fighting you. You're fighting me. I'm not fighting you. I just don't understand why you're... You know what? I'll be honest with you. My love. My baby. My wife, if this is how it's going to be, then I really don't give a fuck at this point. I, I don't What care. do you mean, if this is how it's going to be? It's only this way because you're making it this way. I don't know why you're trying to complicate it. I understand that you don't get, you don't, you know, you don't have the love for Bondi anymore. That's fine. I do, I'm sorry, though. I don't have the love for my family that I built. I'm sorry. Listen. Really? I do. You're gonna mock me like that? Yeah, because you you sound ridiculous. Okay, if you don't, you or, or like you want somebody to pity you. I love you. I am telling you, I made a decision with you to stay with Bondi, and I'm sticking to that decision. Obviously, that didn't work out so great for you. But why can't I try to make it better? I don't know. Whatever you want to do, that's up to you. I want to go to I, bed. I just, yeah, I'm sure you do. I really don't fucking get you sometimes. I, I really don't. you know, I'm not that difficult to get. You are that difficult. No, I'm not. No, I'm yeah, not. you are. No, you I'm not. You're just spoiled, you just and you me want you me. Love me. I do love you. That hasn't changed. You just want me to do what you want to do. Like all the it's time. It's not about what I want to do. You be BBMC. I don't give a fuck. Liar. Stay BBMC. Lies. Yeah, it is a lie. I'll be honest with you. I want you to be with me. I'm but still with I, you. I gotta fight. I gotta fight with my fucking wife. Of all things with this shit old club. Nobody told care. you that you had to fight with me at all. You don't Just have to fight with me. To You're choosing do. to fight with me right now. So what am I supposed to do? Just. Do whatever you gotta you know. do. You do what you know. You do what you yeah, gotta do for your club. Myself. 
No, you gotta do. You do what you gotta do for your club. I'll do what I gotta do for my club, and we will do what we gotta do for each other.